Do what? Turn the volume on. It's Mo, Sam O, Kirill, and Alex. Good times in the morning. Kirill, I love that outfit. What's going on over here? This is uh, somebody said, Nandito na principal. It almost looks like a period piece horror film. Uh, I love it. It looks so good. What a contrast between what you're wearing and what, say, Sam is wearing today. Sam is just full casual. What is going on this early? Very demure, very mindful. Is it I like too it. much? Like no. Well, I mean, what's the occasion? This Don't tell like- you dressed up like this for the radio show. No, I mean, because it'll be my outfit na for the whole day. You know, being mindful of oh, the earth. Great. Thank you. That's is the first showtime nga. Is what, I just thought it was a little wearing. early, but you look... Is convinced. it a little... Oh, eh? It's a little or... early. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little early. <laughs> I mean, you had you had back-to-back cinema roles, and then all of a sudden, you have, you know, down I to ran Abbey. out. I ran out <laughs> of cinnamon rolls. I did see a little girl in a Kuromi shirt yesterday. I was thinking, parang di ko kaya yung Kuromi energy. Apparently, who you like, yeah. The Sanrio world reflects who you are in real life. And I got some judgment from this little girl who looked at my Hello Kitty in my bag like, oh, you're a Hello Kitty. She's <laughs> like, whoa, child. How old was this girl? I can't remember. But she was saying that I had some whatever energy. And I was like, main character energy because I'm Hello Kitty. Kitty. Yeah, Wouldn't I just like, like her ribbon? No, and ma'am. The fact, and the fact that she's four apples tall. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the show, everybody. It is a Tuesday morning. You're listening to Good Times here on Magic 89.9. It's the 10th of September. The entire crew, I believe, is going to be here today. Minus Bam, of course. Bam's going to be here on Thursday. But I uh, recall Mara saying something. She will be in studio with you, Sam, today. Let's see if that comes to fruition. Alex should be here as well. Phone number is 8631 if you want to call us. Get yourself on the show. Hi to all the people streaming us worldwide on playback.tv slash good times. Uh, three hours. Let's see what we can fill it with. I think there's a lot to talk about. I think there's a lot to do. I hope you guys have a lot of fun. And it'd be great if we hear from you guys, which would be just swell. I uh, came across this Taylor Swift song from her kind of more recent album, and I love it. Oh. Why what do you like it? it? Does Hold it have on, a cuss word? Back. I've not, I mean, I, I heard it for the first time today. I was like, I'm playing it on the radio. Does it have a cuss word? Probably. Warm well, those e. fingers to bleep well, it out, e, but mister. I'm sure, I, mean, I think it's a revenge song. When it's, I'm going to get you back, it's not like I'm going to get you back into my life. It's I'm going to get you back, bitch, is what it is. So let's Ugh. hear. I love this song. It's cringy. Love it. Here's Swift at 612. Good morning, everybody. like short skirt. Good times. I'm going to get Taylor Swift there at 616. And man, I did not realize we have a 615 commercial break here, Sam. So that's my bad. Uh, I was actually going to talk a little bit after this one. A lot of commercials, Kay. You know, people are listening. We're doing great, people. Let's keep it going. Did you want to talk about how it was your travel buddy who recommended the song? I was just kidding, guys. My goodness. What? No, No, everyone's like lapping it up. Yeah. Well, um, it's a good song, isn't it? I like the one where parang layo niya sa mic. Like, I was sorry. Which one? I wasn't paying much attention. <sighs> I like how my concern was like, is there a cuss word? But instead of a cuss word, there is actually like cussing you out as, you know, the lyrics. Yes, as an option. Uh, uh, I yeah, like yeah. this song a lot. Um, I... Well, we need to take a break. It is 6.17 because we usually don't do a 6.15, but we do have one today. So let's take a break when we come back. Oh, look, breakfast. Yeah, she needs to eat her breakfast. No, no. The she egg looks like is already ready. She looks like she's part of your outfit. Yeah. <laughs> she looks like she'd be a good rice topping. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Baby. <laughs> save me. Oh. They should look like they should, should get the turtle treatment. No. The rest of them. Okay, got it. We'll take a break. When we come back, we'll have more of the show. Don't go away. Listen to Good Times here at Magic 89.9.
good times. You know, I read this uh, great comment on playback from a Pinoy radio fan. He said, "Ang ganda siguro ng mga dance moves, dance moves nito if this were a newer anthem." Like, it kind of made me think: Were there songs do you think we missed out on with the TikTok craze because it just came out before TikTok started? Um, Though, I mean, you get like a bye 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 every now and then, come back. Because, well, that's mm-hmm. probably because it's associated with the movie. But you think there are songs out there that, like, damn, if there was a social media around, this would have been a freaking banging video. What was a big anthem back in the day? Never mind. <laughs> you guys, never mind. You think, student. <laughs> never mind. Never that, mind. That, that song, though, actually, it's one of those songs that I'm surprised you like. I love that song. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> it's really, it's it's, really bubblegum catchy. It's... You know. <laughs> I don't you, know, you, know, you know what I don't like? What? People this who TikTok are not thing. sweet but normal. <laughs> no, this TikTok thing, this um, this sh- uh, what is this? Give me the money. What is show me the something? Oh my god, I can't see that. Like it, it sucks from the day one, and everybody who's done one sucks. Which one is Whoa. this? The one that like the what is it? Is it the how? How does sh- it go? Uh-uh. I don't know if it's <laughs> give me the money, give me my money, or whatever. It's the ah, dumbest you suck one. because you did it. <laughs> <laughs> it's the dumbest one. Do you agree? I uh, don't even know what that is. I think I, I you saw line a up really like bad five version people, of it. And then they do, the, they do like they give me my money and then they leave one out and everyone just stands there. It's like, it's God, it's so dumb. Oh, I've and, seen it, but it didn't finish the thing. So I didn't it understand. So I was like, bad. I'm about to skip. <laughs> Um, and I don't know how people just all of a sudden caught on to it and said, yeah, we're going to make our own. And I have like friends that I respect who have made one. And I'm like, why? <laughs> that has been the worst. That's got to be the worst TikTok trend uh, that I've seen in a really long time. Hmm. I would say. I What's your least favorite one that you can recall? Trend? Yeah. Maybe yung Ice Bucket Challenge. Oh, you weren't a fan because of that. Because I couldn't understand how I was going to do it myself. That's it. <laughs> Our brains aren't here today, no? Like, we're slower, right? I feel like we're slower. Not I, because I don't, answer, I don't right? go on like TikTok a lot. What I like to do on TikTok is to watch this woman who sells wigs, and she does this, and then she brushes the wig, uh-huh. and then she changes the wig, and then she wears the next one, manga me, manga me, and I want to buy it all. That's Weren't you wearing one TikTok. the other day or something? Your hair was very long the other day. Uh, uh, those were extensions. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Yeah. But the wigs, if you buy them from this woman, it's just like, best price, best quality, me. Are, oh, are they very convincing? You know how like, you know. So convincing. Really? It's a good thing I don't have a TikTok shop. What do you, what do you want? Oh, no, no, Sam. Are you, no, you going to play baseball? Always, yeah. No, Sam's volume is always really low, and she sat. She always sits kind of farther back from the microphone, so her volume is, is considerably low? lower than. She wants to show does. us her beautiful face. I well, no, and I love it. That's why all we could do is so we could see the beautiful face and then just move up the thing a little <clears> bit. But <throat> usually, because it's from the show before, they kind of lower it down. That's why. Anyway, nothing it's technical. Continue, continue, uh, Kay, as you that's were saying. That's it. I just love it. Kaya ako walang TikTok shopping account because I would just buy everything, like those tissues. Yeah. That are one. Peso or point zero zero one centavos. You would buy that. I would buy, it, but I don't have an account because I know if I start, I would never ever stop. Do you know that by the shopping online? Because I do that a lot. It's taken Which, away the the haggling. Um, now I'm a bad haggler. I can't go and ask for discounts. I can't go, uh, you know, haggle prices down at a palenque or at a. Change or whatever. I am terrible at that. But we're seeing less and that less and less of that because there's more purchasing online. Um, do you are you really good at at that? Asking for discounts? But isn't yeah. the online shopping equivalent of haggling just looking for the lowest priced item of the of the same thing? Kind of, no. Waiting like yesterday, nine nine. So there it should be sale till today, actually. Yeah, but sale is sale. This the sale is different from haggling. Haggling the price down. And not just sa- not just it. sale though, because like there are a lot of sellers online and they have different prices for the same thing. So you end up hunting for the best price. 
making sure the so product long. is authentic. Yeah, but it I think that's so the equivalent of haggling. Okay, have any of you guys haggled? Oh, here's a topic. 8631-0899. Uh, playback.tv slash good times. Have you ever haggled over something that was already cheap? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's like it's already cheap, and you still try to get it cheaper. payong payong ten pesos. Win one lang six. Like it's ten pesos already. Like, what are you doing? So, if you've ever haggled something down that was already really low, can you tell us the story? I want to know how cheap it was and how cheap did you try to offer for it. Eight six three one zero eight nine nine is our phone number. You can also again. Get us on playback.tv slash good times. You asked for a better price for something that was already stupid cheap. Um, Oman yes. from Oxford, California says, I was a subscriber to Sirius XM, which is a satellite radio in the U.S., for two years for $5 a month. And then it was uh, terminated. I unsubscribed and was offered seven ninety nine, and then offered four ninety nine, And they said, yes, that's a pretty good deal. Yeah, like 40% off there. Um, oh, my gosh. You could have stuff like that i did not know you could haggle that at Whoa. all uh we're, we're talking about tawad here right so maya says i recently was at a night market in vietnam the shirts cost 250 pesos and when converted they haggled them down to 150 i bought 10 for my pasalubongs 250 is not that cheap i'm talking about stupid cheap haggling but, 250 down to 150 is, is that's that's just kind of it's normal, right? But I like that answer because I think certain settings will bring out the haggler in you. Like, I remember mm. when I would go to the Green Hills Changge, you know, things mm. are generally not that pricey, but that's like, you're supposed to haggle. That's the game. Oh. The night market, yeah, the night market, night market culture is haggle culture. Yes. Yes. Uh, yeah. You have to. Okay. Cool to be in Melbourne says, uh, haggled the whole salmon. It was cheap already because it was the end of the year. Ooh. So 25 New Zealand, is that New, New Zealand NZD, New Zealand dollars, mm. haggled it down to 10 New Zealand dollars. At the end of the day, they gave me three more whole salmon. Whoa. Okay, so it was, try to convert, everybody's got, if you're abroad, try to convert this in pesos, please, for us. So 25 New Zealand dollars for one, and he got three for 10. Oh my gosh, how much is I that? I think yung timing also matters, like, End of the day, no? Uh, 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 yeah, for any uh, kind uh, of, of like bakeries right. or any of that. Mm -hmm. End of the day is always going to get you a fat discount. But oh. it was like again, not sale. You were able okay, to... Not ka pa rin, but your haggling power rises in the beginning uh, and at the end of the day. Because I was before, it was good. That's what I was thinking. It was good. It was good. Then they would be like that. So you have the power. <laughs> you have the power. <laughs> Market Boy says, when I buy fruit uh, with my wife, I think mm. the lemon per kilo is around 35. The wife then invents. She invents that there's somebody, there's a competitor down the, down the, I, uh, down the uh, palenque, there's really none for 25. That was my freebie, pa isang saging. <laughs> <laughs> Throw <with> one banana. <laughs> Love it. Again, again. So, ilanding na ko niya in the end. Okay, That's a kilo. great storyteller. Yeah. Thirty-five per kilo yung dalandan. Got okay. it for twenty-five from a fake seller <laughs> down the, the street, <laughs> and threw in a free one, free saging. <laughs> <laughs> Oh gosh. Perpetual, perpetually sleepy says, I bought a refrigerator magnet in Barcelona. It was two euros and he tried to get it for one. Did it work? <laughs> discount. Instead, he got it for 1.5, one euro. 50. See, you got to take your shot, man. Dude, how do you go down 50% though? You this have to, part. you have to go dramatic for your first offer because you know, they're going to counter that. So you're going to meet somewhere in the middle. But dramatic is 50%? That's pretty dramatic, I would think, for a seller. I mean, yeah. we still have a little bit of class. No, but they all know this dance. Everyone knows this. You have to I dip. Know. Okay, yeah, okay. Super low. Listen, because I don't, hindi ko nagtatawad. I don't know how to ask for a discount. So I'm, I'm at the spot. Say it's 100. Mm. 
what am I saying? What, what's, what's the proper etiquette for me? Like, what am I taking down? 30%? No, you have to go pretty long uh, the first time because they're going to they're gonna haggle back with you. So you're going to go back yeah. and forth a little bit. If they act offended, Mo, that's part of their acting. May ganun din. Ay, nako, okay na, umbalis ka na lang. The more offended they are, the more you stay. Because then you know it's going to be a fun day. <laughs> I want to use this in life now. Oh, you got offended from what I said? That's part of the acting. <laughs> three, eight, nine, nine is our phone number. Let's take our first call. Good morning. Hi. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Hi. Yeah. This? Hi. this is Hannah. Okay. Um, ako din, I'm not really a haggler. Because if I find things cheap now for me, like for example, 100, okay na sa akin. But I... But I would just uh, tell about my mother-in-law na trying to buy a bagoong from my cousin. Na, for yeah. example, it's, it's 90 pesos na. Tapos, sabi pa niya, ay, mahal naman. Tapos parang, for me, it's already very cheap. Kasi malaki naman na siya, like 120. Ano na, parang sa peanut butter. Tapos, mm-hmm. sabi niya, can you just give me a discount? Kasi, you know, usual, usual old people. <laughs> so, yun, yeah. so parang um, I just felt sad and also that that's a relative. So sometimes it happens na kapag relative may nagbebenta, you ask for more discounts pa even if it's cheap. So, so yun. <laughs> that's uh, one of my experiences. So did she get her discount yeah. or not? She did. Ooh. But you know, sad din naman yung, yung relative niya kasi nga um, it, it, it's a business. So sometimes it's just uh, mm. a bit sad that they get uh, they get asked for more discount, even if it's very cheap. Now. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Appreciate Thanks. you. Have a good you. day. All right. Bye. Thank you. Uh, eight six three one zero eight nine. We're talking about haggling tawad people who ask for discounts. I just don't have it in me to do this. Good morning. Hi. Hi. Good morning. Hello. Hi, Hi. Oh, there. This is That's the real the Hannah. Hannah. Okay. Sam. Hi. Come on now, girl. Pretty so similar. I have a rule of thumb for fruit stands. I usually like. Um, haggle less 100 pesos or 150. So yeah. if it's, for mm-hmm. example, 250 per kilo, I go, pwede bang um, 150 na lang? And then I have my magic phrase. Alam mo? What? Maganda kung buwan naman, no? So, it, oh and it's um, true. Yeah, it's true because um, in restaurant, I sit by myself and then I see people coming in right after, always the case. So I say, um, tingnan mo, in a matter of a few seconds, papasok na yung mga tao and it's usually true so I don't know I will it I guess and then people come in right after so I give I get my discount so you know I, I really it. like you I really do you, you I, do. I, really, I, I really do like you but this is about the worst thing you've ever said and that's okay you can't be perfect but I really <laughs> really despise really despise people who think they're lucky charm when it comes to places <laughs> I always you. find it. Every every energy energy is bringing everyone in. Don't Anybody who actually thinks the they're that, they have that kind of power is to me a narcissist. <laughs> I was that just going to say, true. I, I my mother that. passed it on to me. Oh, he's the so player it's now. Genetic. It's the game. Bye. Genetic. Thank All right. you. Bye. I'm now a hater, Hannah. Thank I you. believe you, Hannah. I'm the same. So does that make all of us? <laughs> and these people <laughs> never fail to remind you that they are a lucky charm. Oh, but naman ako, but naman ako. Shut up. Di ka pa kasi nakakuha ng discount mo. Once no. they get your money and make it pagpag. On the, t- the shirts, there is usually an ex- <laughs> there is usually an explanation on why humaba yung pila that has nothing to do with you. And every time I'm with somebody who says, "Oh, banana ako, banana ako," tignan mo lang humaba yung pila. I just do this, or maybe because it's twelve fifteen. <laughs> it's lunchtime. <laughs> You freaking narcissist! But you know what, Mohan? I really hope you feel the first um, thrill of actually getting a discount. It's pretty exhilarating. The first time, though, I get it. Medyo, it's, you know, it's nerve-wracking. But once you, like, break out of your shell and do it that yeah. one time. Oh, my God. Oh, no, my gosh. Don't say break out of your shell. I feel oh. like that means I'll do it all the time. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> it's the best. I, it, okay, this is what it would look like for me. Honestly, huh? honestly, I would be like, <laughs> oh, how much is that? <laughs> and then they'll say, say it's 200. I'll go, but they're 195. Na lang. Like, <laughs> yeah. I would be so... Embarrassed. Five pesos. I'm recovering. No. You would be. You would be shocked. 
you'd be shocked how low they're willing to go. And then you'll realize like, oh my gosh, the margins how on these low things. can you go? Yeah. yeah. A song like that. You guys are crazy. Uh, I got to read some of these answers. There's so many of them. Again, we're talking about haggling, asking for discounts, especially at markets, uh, tawad, all, whatever you guys want to call it. Um, MC Nightmare says, our Sunday market here in Toowoomba. I think that's in uh, either New South Wales, Australia, or maybe even Brisbane. Uh, Toowoomba says, when it's one hour to close, they haggled 90% See? off. I'm there. 90%. Oh. 90. What do you have? No breeding? Oh, good morning. Let's go. We got a bunch of calls here. Hello. Hi. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. Alex here. Alex? Hey. Oh, Alex, Alex. Hi. Okay, yung, uh, ano. So, um, it's. Ah, hindi ako yung tumawa, because I'm not a good uh, haggler. Ang tumawad yung kapatid ko. So, mayroong business yung isang a friend namin. It's a buffet. So, mm-hmm. um, pag-uso yung buffet nung time na yun. So, it's, I think, 249 yung lunch buffet. Tapos yung kapatid ko, um, kinausap niya, pwede bang bigyan mo kami ng discount? Dahil 50%. Dahil 50%. Dahil 50%. How do you even say that? How do you even say that? And it's a buffet. Tapos ako naman, I, I, in, Na-offend ako para dun sa, ano, sa kaibigan namin na, pwede ba, damihan mo na lang yung kain mo kaysa mo humingi ka ng discount. Tama. <laughs> oh, may sense yun. So, so, so ayun, I'm not a good uh, haggler, pero yun yung hindi ko makakalimutan sa pagtawad na, ano ka ba, mangla naman ka pa ng tao. <laughs> 2.49 na yung buffet. 2.49? 2.49 oh na yung buffet. So, binigay yung then, discount? Hindi, kasi ako na yung nahihiya, kasi kasama ako nun. May ano man ako doon sa friend namin. And sabi ko, damihan mo na lang yung kain mo para makabawi ka. So, anong kinain niya yeah, lahat? Uh, Nakailang uh, plato siya? Nakadalawang plate lang naman siya. She's a, she's, uh, she's a girl. So, oh. so mahala ka dyan ka. <laughs> may, may kain mo. No offense ako kaya. Can I, can I, okay, have a good day. Yeah, yeah, okay, that's a great story. story. Have a good day. Thanks, it's, Alex. It's getting choppy. The, what about the threatening to leave tactic, Kay? I do that. Like, if dramahan mo ako, I will give you bigger acting. <laughs> bye, bye. But kung saan ako natakot talaga sa Great Wall of China, we were there for Manopo, and parang I wanted these boots, like army green boots. And then I asked for the price. Apparently, if they put it already in their calculator and show you, and then you haggle down, so ibababa nila. Um. And then you say no. <laughs> Magkagalit sila sa'yo. Oh. That was the one time na takot talaga. I was like, oh no. As in legit Why? galit? Take my money. Oh. So wait, wait. Tell the story. You, did you leave? You threatened to leave? I was leave? pretending you to leave. Oh, yeah, God. I was pretending to leave. But she got really mad because she already gave me one tawad. She I was going did. for a second. Uh-uh. So when I was about to <laughs> pretend leave, she she yelled at me. Oh. So I paid for it na. <laughs> so sometimes it works. Sometimes you will get shouted at. So oh, beware wow. where you are. Yeah, you ever do this? The fake, fake, fake Fakey, exit? Fakey. Of course. <laughs> but, and but then, I, if she sees you again coming back, uh-uh. you did not find. Yeah, you did not find. But you, did know, not find. But you know, and say again, like in a place like the ano, Green Hills Changge. Wala, wala, wala nang pride, pride. You go crawling back to the best price, even if dinarman mo and you walked out. You go back, change your uh, shirt, <laughs> put a cap on. You're just a different person. I've got like three Everyone caps knows. and three different t-shirts. Everyone knows. Eight six three one zero eight nine nine. Tell us about your tawad skills. Your if, essentially the topic started with you asked for a discount for something that was already cheap. Good morning. Ooh. Hi. Hi, this is Chris. Hi, Chris. Chris, what's up? Yeah, um, about the, uh, yung mag-pre-pretend kang umalis or um, yung fake price. Mm-hmm. I tried that in Green Hills, pero unfortunately, mga three stores magkakakilala pala sila. Or I, that's, oh, that's a really good point. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. I got shut down, so yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That. Or it's the same it, owner, no? Pwede rin. Pwede rin. Yeah. Do you say, e 30 pesos kay, ano, sino, sino? <laughs> Yan, Jong? <laughs> Jong! <laughs> Just kind of yells at him. And then, boom, you're in trouble. Um, 
Let me read a couple. Ralph says, or Rap says, speaking of haggling, I was able to buy the comic book, that Batman comic book that has the Good Times billboard for only $2. What? So he was able to haggle that down. Thank you very much. Wow. That's awesome. Cake says, my current uh, iPhone, the S23 Ultra, original price at 1500 Canadian dollars. He got it down to 800 Wow. That's how price got in. Oh, yeah, it's amazing. Can you know? That's a huge discount. 8631-899. Got a bunch of calls on hold. Let's get to them. Good morning. Hi, who's this? Hi. Hello. Hi, who's this? Good morning. Good morning. Hi, can you turn off your radio, please? Can you turn off your radio, please? Sorry? <laughs> yeah, I believe what Kay said. Oh. I was really hugging. No. Paalis na ako. Hinarangan talaga nila ako. Hinarangan? Oh <laughs> my God. God. Even in Hong Kong. <gasps> kaya hindi never na talaga kami tumatawad in Hong Kong. Whoa. Yeah. So, it, when it's China or Hong Kong, naku, huwag nang tumawad. Yeah. yeah. It's their language, it. guys. Their language, that Chinese language, um, whether it be Cantonese or Mandarin, and especially when they, with their strength in numbers, it sounds really, really intimidating. I think a lot of that is their accent. Um, but yeah, thanks for the call. Appreciate Thank you. you. Have a good day. Okay, good morning. Uh, morning. Na yung una mong tawag. Yeah, but what's the tawag is so, like, it's just 5%, 10%. <laughs> <laughs> then make yeah. it bigger. Uh, Jobo says uh, a towing service six thousand. He offered two thousand. That's so that discount. Like, how do you offer that? The, they countered with four five. He countered with two five. They countered with three five, and we closed at three thousand. See, this is the back and forth. That's the dance. Lex, do you? Tumatawad ka ba sa mga murang mga bagay? Yeah. I mean, um, sa Una pa rin siguro hindi ako tumatawad pag may mga yung mga nagtitinda ng mga yung mga alam mo yung mukhang talaga yung business nila lalo na mapagkain hindi ako tumatawad dyan pero yung mga uh, mga involved yung kotse involved yung mga damit sa green hills tawaran yan pero ako tumatawad ako sa ibang reason kaya ako tumatawad kasi gusto kong ibigay sa ila din yung sukli na imbis na binayara ko sila ng full price yung tawad ko binibigay ko rin sa ila back as a tip. Uh, ang count nun is tip yun. Galing sa akin yun. Hindi yung silang nag-set ng presyo. Parang ako yung emitenyo. Parang akong emitenyo. Yes ko sila kung mabuti ang puso nila. At pag nalaman kung mabuti ang puso nila, hinibigay <laughs> ko rin sa ila yung tinawad ko. Totoo! Totoo! Totoo. Pagkain! Emitenyo pang merienda. Yes, swear. Ay na ginagawa ko sa mga nagtitinda ng mga... Kasi mga ibang... Ayaw ko tumatawad yung mga nagtitinda pa sa... Alam mo na yung mga naglalako ng mga street vendor na oh, pwede bang ano na lang yan? Eh, medyo ayoko nun eh. Um, My thing is, um, Sam, why even do this dance? If that's just gonna happen. Again, for me, uh, it's something um, that kicks in in certain settings. Like Changge, Night Market, Palengke. Like, that's just what you do. That's the oh, culture. Sila naman nagsasabi na may tawad pa. Oo! Oh, oh. Di ba? 600 yep. sir, may tawad pa. Alam naman nila yun eh. Inoopen naman siya. Last day. price, last Man. price. Pero, yeah. I don't, again, I, I don't find myself in these situations. That's why I don't even notice. Like, this is all new to me. Uh, ACGA says, same experience uh, with K in Singapore. Um, in Seoul, Korea, sabi pa nila, Pilipino, pwedeng tumawad. <laughs> is what they're talking about. In so Seoul. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um... Well, let's see. Oh, I thought I saw a really good one. Oh, I can't can't see it now. Okay, someone at FB Marketplace posted a BGC9 Prism Doncic rookie card, 32K, asking. Uh, the slab had some scratches on it, so he haggled it for 9K free shipping, and the guy said yes. Yeah. So that's not really haggle. Yeah. That's a scam. To go 32 to down to 9, that's... Probably a fake card. Um, 8631 Let me read one more here real quick and then we'll get to that call. Or oh, you can you put that call. Uh, Good. You can throw it in and let me just read this one off. Um, Ramen Noodle says, we went to Hong Kong Ladies Market in Mong Kok in the morning and the evening. The first night we asked for a bag that was worth 400 Hong Kong dollars. Too pricey. So when we were about to leave the vendor, she gave it the discount and priced the bag at 250 Hong Kong. It was still a no. So they came back. I'm assuming the next... Oh, and then it became 100 Hong oh Kong. Oh, my gosh. So we bought the bag. 
And then on our last day in the morning, we went back to the store to buy a cute book that we asked for from the other night, 80 Hong Kong to 35 Hong Kong. I guess what, for the same bag? See, look at at the margins. Like, I mean, these people are going to sell at that price point and will still probably make a profit. And there you are buying it off of like the initial offer. There's no way. No. Alex is giving the money back. Yeah, yeah, what is that about? He must an ermitano. Did you not listen? But that's you more for himself. Okay. Eh, eh, ano yung, yung maganda lang yung doon yung ano, yung proseso ng tawaran. Para kasi ano yan eh. Saya. Yung negotiation. Oo. Uh-uh. It's an art form. Parang chess match. Uh-huh. Chess match. Oo. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. This is your tawa, move. Tawa. This is there, my yeah. move. You're not just there for the discount. You're there for the, for the, um, yeah. win. Parang win yun eh. Plus, if you're a flirt, then you can release your flirting skills and not hurt anybody's feelings. Mano. Oh, Mano. I have a friend who has a great line. Like, mm. even for like, she'll be, kahit para second. If she gets denied or shut down. <laughs> 50%. I, ano lang kasi, mamit, 15%. Kahit para second. <laughs> she says, <laughs> she's so good at it. <laughs> Oh, yeah. oh, alam ko, nararamdaman ko manong may mabuti kayong puso. Ayun. Ay, wow. Alam niyo sa loob niyo kung ano talaga ang tunay na presyo nito. Pwede kong bilhin yan sa binibigay niyong presyo, pero pag alis ko dito, kaya niyo bang mabuhay? Wow. Na may naloko kayo isang tao. Wow. Kasi <laughs> binibigay na lang sa akin eh. Ito na boss, sa inyo na lang. Parang ang sama-sama ako eh. Emotional Anong blackmail dito, is ha? worse. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got to take a break. <laughs> running, running out of uh, time here. It is 6.49 on uh, this Tuesday morning. You're listening to Good Times here on Magic 899. Para. Para. Sir Akin. How do you do it again? How do you do it again? Para Sakin. <laughs> She's so hard. I swear. Patele <laughs> Sakin. <laughs> this is the princess. Back after this. Don't go away. Good Times. Too soon to tell you I love you. You're the Chrissy Abrams at 6.55 on this Tuesday morning with Risk. Four of us here on the show. We should be five as soon as Mara wakes up. Does not look like she's going to make it to the booth. Today. <laughs> <laughs> and if I recall correctly, I think she was like, on Tuesday, I'm in the booth. 100%. Yeah. In the- yeah. <laughs> she didn't give a time. <laughs> You're right, though. She, she did give not a give a time. percentage of how sure she was she was going to be on the show today. Mm-hmm. Last last two minutes. <laughs> um, it is again almost seven. I don't know if you guys. What time does school start usually? Seven thirty. Oh. Seven. Oh. Seven. Early, no. Yeah, we got a couple kids mm-hmm. here still. Mm-hmm. Actually, the reason why I'm asking is, I, I'm kind of curious with bullying being so on the radar of everybody, but you have more tools at your disposal to bully other kids not like maybe back in the day but back in the day i think bullying was not as policed do you think it's worse now than it was in previous generations i don't know i haven't heard of anyone getting bullied yes it's worse now bullying is worse now than it was when we were younger yeah Alam nila. Yung alam nila doon, bubuli ka niyan sa mga informasyon na nakuha sa'yo, nagaling din sa'yo. E dito kasi sa, so- sa social media, makukuha na ka rin info based on what you do on a daily basis. Pag nakita yung social media mo, nagpost ka ng something, kinabukasan, naabangan ka sa school, o kaya may message ka. Meaning, walang, walang off, ano ngayon? Walang off parang minutes. lahat open ngayon. Kaya hindi ka to dati, tutuksuin ka lang according sa itsura mo eh. <laughs> Nung araw na yun, malala mo ngayon, hindi ko na ulitin to. Di ba? Aga, halim sa suot ah! O, gano'n ka lang. O, kayang buhok. Pero dito, may magawa ka sa social media, mabasa ng bully, yun ang baon-baon sa'yo. Okay, so there, there, there are some uh, on the playback here, people saying the f- the emotional bullying is harder now. The physical oh. bullying was from back in the day. And it makes Mind you... Mind games. Yeah, it makes you think, what do you want? Like, do you want to get your ass kicked or do you want to have haters? Mm. And 
I've never gotten my ass physically kicked before, but I feel like that's worse. And I'm going to say it was probably bullying was worse before. And the reason because people didn't really care so much that you were getting bullied. Nobody cared. These days, we're quick to point it out. Hey, that's bullying. Hey, that's harassment. You can't do that. Back in the day, it's not that big of a deal. You just you, It was part of life. So I'm going to say it might be worse back then because there's no limit. It could be verbal. It could be physical. Nobody knew what it was. It's just... We just thought it was a rite of passage as you grew up. Now you can identify anything as bullying. So maybe it's less. It's a bit more diluted. I don't know. What do you guys think? Girls. Gosh. I don't know of uh, any bullies kasi ngayon eh. Saka ang bullying nun nag end lang sa school. Dito sa latest ngayon, sinusundan hanggang sa bahay, pahinga ng bata, mm-hmm. dapat safety ka sa bahay. May pahinga yung, ano, yung bullying dati. Ito ngayon, walang pahinga because of social media. Kaya sa tingin ko mas grabe. Social media? Yun. I have receipts though. Hindi, well, kahit na. Ibig sabihin, pipatawin ka ba kung anong mas worse ng bully? Mas worse ngayon kasi walang, walang ano ngayon, walang hangganan ng bullying. Kasi pag dati sa square lang, iwasan mo na nagbubuli sa'yo. Okay ka na. Okay, gumampi ka lang sa isa pang mas matapang eh. Tapos ka eh. Okay na eh. Hindi ka na makakarinig ng bullying. Basta may mga diskarte. Ngayon, hindi mo nga alam kung anak mo binubuli. Kasi malihim sila sa social media at umaabot kahit sa safety ng bahay. Dapat kasi yung bahay, ayan yung pinaka-safety net mo eh. Makarating ka na sa bahay, wala ka na, meron ka ng... Pero ngayon, sa loob mismo ng bahay, may nangyayari Hating gabi. 861, yeah. 861, Let's get some calls here. Um, again, the question is really is bullying worse now in previous generations or worse uh, or worse now or versus previous generations? Good morning. Hello, good morning. Hi. Hi, who's this? Hi, short down guy here again. Uh, yeah, you sound like you've been uh, been through uh, the ringer here. Okay, so tell us. I agree with, with Alex Samo. Kasi wala ka ng safe space especially on social media. Um, malimit yung mga binubuli nga sa social media ngayon. Nagsa-shutdown na lang ng, ano eh, ng profile nila dun sa mga social media accounts nila. Or, Listen, you, okay, sorry to cut you off, but you have an old school mentality though. How old are you? 43. Okay, 43, right? So, look, you could tell that this guy's from our generation, Lex. Why? Hey, welcome to the show. Who's this? Short tongue guy. <laughs> you know, in our, back in our day, your physical, your physical disability was your nickname. Now, yes, yes. That's bully. Yeah, I can't go up to somebody. Uh, I can't go up to a fifteen-year-old now and go, "Hey, short tongue guy." I would get, I would get in trouble. Yung you, dati kasi short tongue guy natin. You've owned it. Natin, as we said, we said that. Sa kaibigan ng natin ginagawa yon. Oh, kasi ngayon, eh, ngayon, 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 pagka, ngayon ano kayo, free for all tayo ngayon eh. May, hmm. may mga nagko-comment sa'yo na hindi mo kakilala eh. Wala ka na so, ligtas kasi oh. with the people who you don't know. Lalo na pag naka-public yung account mo sa ano sa social media. Pag nakita nila yan and nag-viral, puputpuri ka nila ng mga comments on ano. Minsan nga, anonymous yung account nila. Mag, may message pa nga sila sa'yo anonymously eh. And doon ka rin nila titrahin emotionally. Dati kasi, yeah. uh, nung, or well, nung bata tayo, mapag-away ka lang, mapagsantuhan ka lang. Tapos na yung bullying doon. Pero ngayon, ano eh, uh, it will haunt you kahit na mag, uh, mag-close ka man ng account mo. I-hunt ka, ka pa rin nila kasi may mga retibo sila nakatago like yung mga screenshots ng mga post mo, mga account mo, mga comments mo, etc. And pictures mo as well. Got it, got it. Thanks for the call. Appreciate it. Have Thank you. Okay. Bye. Hey, 631's were 899. Is bullying worse these days than in previous generations? We've got a bunch of calls here. Preferably people who've been bullied, you know, your young generation. You can tell us maybe how hard it is right now. Lines are full. Good morning. Good morning. Hi. Hey. Good morning. Hi. Yes. I think bullying is worse when it was way in the 90s. Yeah. Yeah, because uh, where but in our school if it's today it's 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 combined it's physical and it's emotional so, so wait it's th- worse back then or worse now worse back then okay. because there was a physical component to it both you, you have yeah. uh emotional and you have physical 
Yes, and back. It, it, actually, I, I disagree. If if right now you're in social media, just turn on your social media and you, you don't read anything. Yeah. If you, if I, I, got a nin, I got a ninja star thrown at me uh, when I was younger. Um, if you guys ever know what that is, that cannot happen now. You, it would, it would, just, that would be crazy. Yung panahon namin, merong yung yung walis tambo ipapasok sa gitna ng between your legs, and both of them were going to do that to you. So I, I have, I have schoolmates right now that they still don't go to reunions because of what. <laughs> We've done to them, or what other people have done to them. No, we've called names. What? what. Then yung siya sabi mo makapagsuntukan ka. Then tapos na hindi. Even magpagaidans ka at the back of the head, they're going to still yeah. bully. Yeah, I, did, I, did, I didn't agree with that as well. Like one suntukan yeah. all of a sudden fixes everything. That's not, no, it's not. It's not the reality. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thanks for the call. And min- minsan yung suntubukan na o oh, hospital yung tao. I mean, I, I had a friend na nangyari sa kanya yun. RG says, um, worse dati. Kahit yung ma-teacher dati, <laughs> nang bubuli. <laughs> That's really good. Kasi, kasi hindi, kasi dati, you have to be physically, may bully, ano ka dapat? Bully, physical aspect ka. Meaning you're bigger, you're like, alam mong pag naita mo, kaya ko ba to? Hindi. Pag naita mo sa magharapan, sinong bully dito? Merong uh-huh. identifier. Eh ngayon, si mayroong mga keyboard warrior eh, na kahit na pag nakita mo sa personality ko, pwede nang bubuli sa akin. So, <laughs> ibig sabihin, lahat ngayon may capability to bully, kahit hindi naman sila capable talaga in real life. Hindi katulad dati, kaya limit lang na, may maliit na bata, bubuli mo ako, katukang kita. Mm-hmm. Eh, saka hindi naman lahat ng, dat- ng dati bully eh, iba away eh. Ah, uh, may suntukan talaga tayong dalawa, may ganun. Mm-hmm. Pero i-cry pa natin yung bully, yung bullying, wala ka namang ginagawa pagpasa mo sa eskwelaan. Tutoksoyin ka ako, may balat ako sa mukha dati. Balat, balat, balat. E na umuwi ako sa bahay. May problema ako sa balat ko. Nag-i-imagine ako, paano kaya mawawala to? Yung may balat ako, I was bullied. Pero because of my, ano, my physical, ano. Pero other than that, they don't know anything about me. Wala silang tinutokso sa akin na about my personal life. Kasi ang physical lang nakikita nila. And ang bully, kailangan ka, may kakayaan ka mag-bully nung dati. Ngayon, pwede ka mang bully at any age. Dahil nakatago ka sa keyboard. So mas worse ngayon kasi lahat may kakayang magbully basta marunong ka lang sa magugut sagot eh. Pero and, I wonder kasi and emotional, 'di ba? Emotional ng lalo ngayon kaya nga marami nag tumasang suicide sa kanin. Anyway. Pero I wonder about yung sinasabi ni mo kanina, yung may resibo eh. So kung binuli ka online, magsusumbong kaya yung mga bata kasi pwede mo i-screenshot yun eh. Yeah, receipts. Oo, may resibo talaga eh. Pero But sumbong it... kasi dati, oh, dalin mo yun sa guidance para nga ganun ano. Yeah, it'd be like a he said, he said thing, or she said, she said. It, it, this, right. I actually have receipts. Which makes it worse, right? And then I can send it to people who can do something. What? Which makes it worse. I mean, does the making sumbong thing make it yeah. better ever? Uh-uh. No, I think sumbong now is, is it's easier to do now than back in the day. Back in the day, kung sumbong ka, you, sumbongero ka, you're going to get your ass kicked for that too. Now, mm-hmm. I think it's a much more acceptable um, response. And you don't pay for it. So again, I'm still going to go with, I think it's, it was a little bit worse back in the day. But I think, we, again, we have, we have differences. May papasahin lang ako isa dito sa comment. Worse before kasi hindi sila aware na bullying ngayon. Um, mm. Medyo mali yung, mali yung, kung hindi ka aware. So ibig sabihin, worse before kasi hindi sila aware na bullying. So kinukuha mo ako ng statistic na walang awareness dati. And that's a very, very uh, malabong statistic. Marami kasi dati hindi tayo aware na bullying. Oo, marami tayong kinakategorize na bullying ngayon. Pero um, I, 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 sur- I survived, personally speaking, no? doon sa bullying. Kasi ang, ang sarap gantian ng, uh, ano, eh, ng, ng, ng aral, ng kala, konting change. Ngayon talaga, yung anak ko biglang magsasabi sa akin, Daddy, may, ano, yun, may nambubuli sa akin. Sabi ko, anong, ano, anong, ano, itsura, hindi yan, nag, nag-message message sa akin eh. Alam niya, mukhang sa classmate ko sa school, mga ganun. O kaya schoolmate ko. May umaabot sila doon sa alas 8 ng gabi, nagsasay tayo anak mo ng ganong bullying. Walang tayinga ngayon eh. Eh, yun ang pinakamatindi. Mm. Oh. go back to the last caller, Lex. Stop being on phone then. <laughs> Ete, pero para maipag-communicate ka sa kaibigan mo, it's the same way. Kasi dati, pagka binubuli ka, merong isang mga lugar na may pahinga ka eh. Takbo ka sa, pag may, may teacher sa classroom, umi-stop sila. Pag may kasama kang mas matinding, ano, may stop sila. Um, 
ang pagkakaibigan din napuputol dati no kasi sumasama ka sa mga kaibigan mo. Huwag mo sabihin tate, pag binubuli ka, huwag ka pumunta sa eskwelahan. Parang ganun sila sa mo eh. Yung, no, no, yung no, no. I mean like, okay, like, okay, let's say, let's say, and, and I, I did not go through this. I don't want to say like I was kind of victim of bullying because I really don't think I was, even though categorically you could probably say yes, it's bullying. Um, most of it was about my height, my name, you know, things like that. Oh, that's every day. But I think in the past there was a bullying where you were scared to walk down a specific street that you needed to go use when you were going to go home because you're going to get your ass kicked. That fear does not exist anymore these days that compared to, I think, back in the day. I don't know if you guys have had that. It's the where, same as, ang problem ang social media yung way natin to communicate with friends and to socialize. And if you, and at, ay, hindi nang hindi nang ginagamit ng mga bully to bully you. Hindi ka tulad dati, isang maliit na daan, pwede ka maumuiwas eh. Hindi mo, hindi matitigil yung pagkakaibigan. See, that's what I'm no? saying about right now. Pwede ka na umiwas, don't go on pero, your phone. Pero yung same, yung pinapaiwas sa'yo is the same street kung saan yung kaibigan mo. Ibig sabihin, yung social media is the same way kung saan ka na ipagkaibigan ngayon sa mga kabataan ngayon. Na pag pinastop mo, you're, you're telling them to, communicate, to stop communicating to all. Hindi ka tulad dati, pag sinabihan ka na, ay, ayoko dumaan dyan, tuloy pa rin ang buhay mo because there are five streets mm-hmm. alternative mm, to, go, yeah. to go to your friends. Hindi ka na mawawala ng kaibigan. Hindi ka tulad yung social media, pag sinabihan mong, patay mo yung social media mo, Uh-oh. pinapatay mo rin yung communication mo. Sa or siguro mo. blocking or restrict. Blocking, o. Oh, eh, kaya pag nag-mukha ng bagong ano, account. <laughs> uh, mahirap <laughs> din. Uh. Oh. Pero kasi pag nag-block ka, mababasa mo pa rin yung mga masamang nasabi. Siguro oh, pa pag mo sa... Niyo, alam mo siya sabi, iwasan mo yung ano, iwasan mo yung social media. Pero um, ano to eh, social media is the same place where your friends are. Hindi ka tulad sa uh, dati na street, physical na street. Ay, ayaw ko dyan, may, may kaaway ako dyan eh. Which is ginagawa naman natin kung di bully, kahit na hindi bully. Ay, may utang ako dyan eh. Umiiwas ka dun eh. Pero tuloy pa rin ang buhay mo. Uh-huh. Doon sa iba ibang kanto. Maganda yung restrict kasi yung bully, akala niya nababasa mo pa rin yung sinasabi niya. Pero you've actually blocked them. But they don't know that. Mm. And that's Or what mute. I want And that's a really yeah. good point, Kate. Because Jay here says, to your point, most social media becomes that alley that you should avoid. No, I can... See, the thing is, if I'm walking on that alley, and that, you're going to use that, that kind of analogy, I can erase all the bullies from that street. Yes, it's still the alley, but I can start taking, they can start disappearing. Pero they Back can create the day, another, they, they can create disappear. another account. Hindi ka tulad nung sa alley, they cannot disguise. And I, will, <laughs> and, I will block, and I will block that too. I mean, people get tired. People will get tired making accounts over and over. Good morning, Mara. How are you? Hi, Mara. Good morning. Oh, nice voice. Good morning. Prepare for trouble. I know. I love your intros. I love your intro. What do you think the topic is, Mara? Now that you've come in, come in mid-talk. <laughs> um, bullying. Yeah, what about it? I know. I know. Social media. Social media bullying. What else? What do you think the question is? Um... The question is, um, how do people bully nowadays? Close, yes. It is. Is bullying worse now than it was in previous generations? Yay. It's <laughs> 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 and I lines are full. Let's um, ask this question to the people. Let's see what they got to say. Good morning. Hi. Hey, morning. Good morning. Hi. Uh, in terms of Bullying now and before. I, I think, yung, like what Alex said, um, it's a lot more prevalent and it's a lot worse today as it uh, compared previously. Siguro ng mga time natin, time ko, mm-hmm. personally. Kasi, yung, tulad ng sister na sabi niyo ngayon, um, you have to remember also, yung may, may certain mindset din kasi yung taong binubuli, hindi lang yung nabubuli. Ang, ang taong binubuli, ano na kagad eh, emotionally, ano na siya, vulnerable na eh. So yung to the point of Alex na uh, yung walang peno na na nangyayari. Siyempre hindi yan nagsusumbong tulad nung uh, dati, hindi rin nag-ano yan. Yung ang nangyayari na lang, lalo nagsashot in yung binubuli. So slowly nag-erode dun sa emotion ng tao yun eh. 
Oh, because because it's not so much like physical as it used to be. Yes. Yes. But it's more so, destructive now. Yeah, it eats away slowly. Slowly it eats away. Yeah, yung yung ano yari yan? Ah, uh, mas long term ang emotional damage talaga. Kasi physical. Oh. Minsan ano lang yan, eh, di ba? Physical. O oh, yung sabi mo ngang nabuli ka na minsan yung mga mean pranks na ginagawa. Merong, may may ano din yan, may tapak din yan, pero uh-huh. pag emotional sa loob ng kain sa iyo eh. Mm. You know, it's funny that a lot of the guys that say that say this are these guys that parang yung barako to, alam mo, they lang yan, sutukan lang yan. You know, like that kind of voice. There is <laughs> And I think it's because you maybe could have held you held yourself really well with the fist, but I would like to hear from a person who got so physically abused, walking or in school or daily or weekly or whatever, and ask them what that does. Where that oh, when you're bleeding and your face is uh-huh. swollen regularly because you look yeah. a certain way, how that affects you. Now, a lot of the guys, it does sound like when you guys are calling that you could probably fight back. But oh, ako, I'm sorry. when you're so thrown in a room like and locked inside there, when you are, your underwear is, you, your pants are off and they've taken you and they made you walk around naked and that has been your life. I'm, I'm yeah. going to pick, I'm going to pick a couple of haters on IG over that. That's not um, me. Ito ha, ang worst pa dito is, yung dati, pag umuwi ka, may dugo ka, may, may pasa ka, alam ng nanay mo at tatay mo na may oh. nang, it's either napaaway ka, nabulik ka. Wala ka makikita ng ano ngayon eh sign ngayon sa mga kabataan yeah. na bull. Wala so, silang physical mo. sign. Ay nang dangerous sa akin eh. Kasi oh, dati yeah, nung nakita yeah. ko ng anak ko, ay ano nangyari? Kausapin natin 'yan. Kailangan may may mangyari diyan sa ano kasi may nakikita akong physical. Ang problema oh. kasi ngayon, hindi mo na malaman kung ano nangyayari sa mga as a father ah. May dalawa akong anak na lalaki. As a father, mas gusto ko nakikita anak ko na may may physical ano kaysa yung nakikita kong tahimik yung pala ginugulpi pala yung loob. At ang dami ngayon noon kaysa dati. Kasi dati pag umuwi ako, may, may, may pasa ako, tatanungin ka agad ako. Ano nangyari sa'yo? Ma, na, napaaway ako. Ano yan? Na-address. Agad-agad. Ngayon, di mo alam yung anak mo, natutulog, gumigising sa umaga. Emotionally boost. Hindi mo makita eh. Oh. I think a caller was also saying that he was physically bullied. Yeah, yeah. I, I was, I, yung, yung what you described mo, I was like that. Uh, I was the one being bullied before. I wonder in the current in the current day, your bullies, your keyboard warriors, all that stuff, your keyboard bullies, what do they look like in person? Because uh, the bully back right. then it's, it's a, looked it's like a you could hold, you could, you could hold this stuff. I don't know. It's a hodgepodge. Yeah, I don't know. Walang wala namang ano yun eh, certain look yun eh. Um, I know, but, 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 but I, if I trace them down, can I fold them when I see them in person? Because are all, are all of them also the biggest guys in on the internet? Oh, no. no. So I will fold na na that mother effer when I see him in person, yes? Ah, uh, no, no. <laughs> Kasi there are times na magugulat ka. Ano nga eh, sinasabi ni Alex, anonymity in social media, unfortunately, release the devil inside you eh. Sasabihin mo, ah, walang consequence. Sige, tirahin natin to social media, ganyan. Masyadong ano, wala na. You know, wala I, think, na... I think it comes down to really, maybe maybe this is not the question to ask. It's how the individual can take this yes. level of... Lagi namang may ganong factor. Ganun, 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 I mean, look at, let, let's, look at, let's look at Taylor Swift, for example, okay? Uh, biggest star in the world has been, or could be argued, maybe the most popular, famous singer of all time. It could be argued, right? Mm-hmm. Um she is getting hated on since last year because her boyfriend plays football. So she goes to watch these games. And it's not her fault that the TV network always pants to her every time her boyfriend does something. And with, sorry, this is an American context, but there's 350 million Americans, 150 million of them probably watch football, maybe more. Half of the country, easy. And they all hate Taylor Swift. They all do. And I, I, I defend her like crazy because it's not her fault. But cool. so she takes it like a champ. Defense. She's like, F them, I'm going to the next game. F yes, them, I'm going to fly from Japan just to make it to the next game. She doesn't, get offend- she doesn't get affected by it. So maybe the question isn't, is it worse now or then, back then, and which I apologize because that was the question I threw out there, but it's about the individual. What can they take? Um, yung, 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 what can they take? 
uh, di ba sometimes bullying it starts at a young age eh. dahil ang restraint ng person medyo mas mas wala eh mas inhibited pag pag mas bata eh sometimes kasi you don't know the ramifications ng ginagawa mo eh also yung yung do sa binobully ano din yun eh mas wrong emotion ng tao nung pag bata ka di ba um, I don't know yung, it's hard it's hard I think I think we're diagnosing or you have been diagnosing a lot of um what effect it has on people when I really think it's hard to do that. You were saying, you know, mga bata ngayon, eh, yung mga bata dati, eh, kailangan, you know, it, 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 sumasakit niya sa loob. You know, you're saying things like you're actually as if, I, I'm not 100% sure I can follow what you're saying when you give uh, general statements like that. But nevertheless, good call. It's, good not, call, general, it's not general kasi, you know, I've, I've seen examples. Eh, for, from my daughter, there's an example already as well. Eh. Yung yun sinasabi ni, ni Alex kanina na hindi mo alam binububog na sa loob. That, that was my predicament before. That's why alam mo yun, as a parent, hindi po, ako kasi, I, I'm a 350-pound guy. I'm a 6'2", 350-pound guy. Yung, yung nakita ko yung gano'n, alam mo, gusto ko punta niyo skwela, gusto ko i-itsa sa bintana yung, yung nambubuli nung sa anak ko. Ang tagal-tagal na, pero hindi mo nalalaman. Yun yung mahirap na nakakatakot talaga sa gano'n. Yep, yep. All right, thanks for the call, brother. Appreciate Thank you. you. All Thank right. you. Good day. All right. Six two three fifty. Yeah. Hey, do you know about that hit Korean show? Uh, yeah, hit Korean show where she was bullied when she was young. She was like punched, like pinasu siya ng iron. Oh, the glory, and the glory, yeah. and then she spent her whole adult life actually, planning spent revenge, her whole life building up to her uh, adult years, planning her revenge. Uh 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 uh. And everybody was rooting for her to destroy their lives. Well, that was a recent one. That's right, right? Yeah. yeah. Sorry. Yeah, and I remember seeing that one. Loosely based on a true story, apparently. Oh. Is thing. it? That was a true story? That's I intense. Yeah. It is 7.20 on this Tuesday. Wait, did you go, anything you want to say, uh, Sam? Okay, sorry. I kind of, kind of overtook took that one over. But anything you want before we say our break? Oh, no, I, I don't know anything about bullying presently, so I can't really speak. But yeah, I am my Inaanak is listening. Hi, Sans and Trina. Hi. The one who says, Kahit mas para sa akin. <laughs> <laughs> She's listening. They're on their way to school. Hey, guys. We'll take a break. When we come back, more of the show. Don't go away. Good times. Sadis and Ray at 727 on this Tuesday morning. You're listening to Good Times here on Magic 89.9 with the group. Yes, all five of us are here. The GNLU representing. Um, that is Kay right there, the leader. Um, <laughs> oh, we did a roll call. Yes, yes. We did <gasps> oh my gosh, that's Adam right. Adam. We didn't. La good The people. Um, later, I said, uh, no, relax. Oh, oh stop. Stop. Ooh. <laughs> Myra right there with the stretch. Uh, Sam's in studio. Alex, of course, myself. 8631-899 if you want to call us. Get yourself on the show. Playback.tv slash good times. If you want to get on the stream, you can see us off air. You can interact with all the other listeners. And now is a really good time as well to do this background and talk about all the things that we want you guys to be a part of our lives. Lex, you've got the longest list. You get to go first. What's going on, brother? Uh, um, uh, see you in this uh, Saturday, September 14th sa Echo Bar. At yung birthday show ko, last week na kayo ng Early Bird, uh, October 4 and 5, uh, Maybank Theater, October 11, Music Museum, October 12, Insular Life, Palabang, Ticketworld.com.ph at um, tuloy pa rin yung ating uh, appliances promo. Five tickets, one electric one, ten tickets, uh, one uh, electric oven, fifteen tickets, uh, air purifier, and twenty tickets, refrigerator, tawasapi at um, alexcalia.com. And see you sa uh, Olonga po, September 20 to 22, and Baguio, September 27 to 29. And um, sa Australia, November 8, Perth, November 9, Adelaide, November 15, Sydney, November 16, Melbourne. AlexKedet.com and TheComedyCrew.com Maraming salamat sa Katinko and sa Sharp Philippines and kita-kita mamaya magpa-practice ako ng joke dyan sa Ortiga sa Los Chachos Mexican Restaurant Thank you Anyone hey, next? Sam, how about you? Me? Okay So today after the show at 11.30 I'm gonna be over at Vantage Point Media to join a show called 
What happened? Why is there so much static? Sorry, your volume you is so low. I what? do not hear you. Yeah, it's I'm almost like cool. maxed at this point. No, there's yeah. like a hiss. Uh-uh, yeah, there's a static it's sound. So weirdo looking. Yeah, okay. Anyway, go ahead. You're okay. Saying. Um, although, yes, on the playback, we're looking at the poster for Best News Ever podcast, which we live stream every Saturday at 11 a.m. on the Zion Christian Mission Center Facebook page. We talk Bible, faith, God, all that good stuff. If you're into it, please check it out. Later on at 1130, I'm going to be at Vantage Point Media to be on a show called Voice of Peace, talking about HWPL, our peace initiatives. We have a huge event coming up, the World Peace Summit on September 18, which I will be flying to Korea. Korea for so catch us if you're interested um what else was I gonna say oh I want to say hi to our friends over at Medify Air Philippines we have a super pretty air purifier inside the booth and also to our friends at Pilot Pens Philippines we have gift packs to give away today if you'd like to do that yeah powerful is some I'm powerful is some wait alam mo Pilot is gonna give you ano Alex they're gonna make pens for you with your logo and stuff I know I'm powerful mo hindi they're just super generous kain talaga yung Philippine Airlines si Bob Pinky at Air ano at Air Asia talaga sino kaya tutulong sa akin dito Karil pero tulong mo ba ako sa Philippine Airlines uh, Air Asia o Cebu Pacific? I think kailangan natin, katulad ng sinabi ng kanta ni Mo kanina, i-ideate. Yes. Yes. <laughs> so, Philippine Airlines, totoo. Air Asia, Cebu Pacific. Philippine Airlines, Air Asia, Cebu Pacific. <laughs> There's a buzzing night. sound. Where is that buzzing sound coming from? Oh, the from airplane the approaching. The airplane approaching. <laughs> 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 you asked for it. <laughs> Mara, see you with, ano, pwede ka ba ngayon sa rep? Ay, sa, sa TV? Uh, sa rep? May hindi na rin. Pwede ka? O, usap tayo mamaya. Ah. Okay. Ganyan tumawad mo. Bibigyan ka sana ng TV. TV at ref na. <laughs> Iba to si Mara mag-promote. Nagpa, nagpa, nagpakulo ng rappel sa air. <laughs> yeah, pero tayo, guys. pwede ano? nila gawin yun. If you invite people, 20 people, ipa-raffle nyo yung fridge within the 20 people. Diba? No diba? way. You're right. <laughs> Maganda yan. Ang talino mo dun. Pero for sure, I'm gonna win that oven, that electric oven. Ah, ten, diba? Ten? Ten. 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 I'm, yeah. So what I'm planning to do is have my boyfriend's belated birthday there and invite all his friends <laughs> and then get the oven. <laughs> Alex Calieja. I'm a powerful This is the protector of my bullies. The enemy has been slain. Protector uh, from my drama is the podcast that I was, did it, is the new season launched last night? Is that what it was, Kay? Yes. Uh, so Kay's drama season two, which we shot in the Spotify office in Singapore, being the first ones to do a podcast in the office. I am so proud. So you can watch it already on your Spotify in app meta na yung video, I think by today. And yeah. It's with DJ Joey Santos and Yael Yuzon, my husband, who's sleeping. Hello. Thank you for taking me to work yesterday. Yeah, Sounds so please good. watch that. And I just want to say, parang shout out lang sa lahat ng gumagawa ng mga videos of us and put and the ones who put it on. Oh my God. Yes. Yeah, on, on Insta. Insta oh so cute. Yeah. We did, we're so cute there. Thank you. Yeah. Mara, and I think, Mara, you said you were going to start something like that as well, right? Just also kind of editing parts of the show and all that oh, stuff. Oh, yeah. My editor. So I'm getting her to to clip parts. Mm-hmm. She she chooses. So she gets to watch it again. But yeah, Alex Calieja, I'm going October 4. Ooh. Yay! Music Museum, Green Hills. Huh? Oh. October 4? <laughs> Music Museum? <laughs> Is it really there? No. Ito, may kanya kanyang powers tayo talaga dito. Si Kate, sabi niya, Uy, si Alice sa Spotify. Thank you, Alex. Hindi ko alam na ako pala yun. Tapos si Mara naman, helping me dun sa... Okay, tal- okay tal- <laughs> tal- magbebenta kami ng merch on the day that we watch. Gusto <laughs> <laughs> mo ba kami mag-front act? Three minutes lang naman, di ba? Stand up. <laughs> oh, no, no. No, 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 no. 8631 is our phone number. But if you want to call us, get yourself on the show. Um, let's see here. Oh, we got uh, gift packs to give away. Why don't we do that? Yeah, actually, do call us. Get on the show. 
And you can win yourself packs from uh, Pilot. Should we just do what we did last time? Two truths, one lie. Everybody wins who calls. Okay, so there's no like you have to win on the two truth, one lie part. If you call the show, you win. It's really about us competing against each other. Uh, mm. And of course, all of this would get logged for Employee of the Week. So 8631-0899, you just have to give us two truths about you and one lie. We'll sit here and try to guess it. Caller number one, you are on the air. Let's fire away. Good morning. Hello, good morning. Hi. Uh, Who is this? Uh, it, uh, I'm Ian. Can you take off the speakerphone, please, so we can hear you uh, better? Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yes. Hi. It not? got worse. How is that possible? <laughs> <laughs> Have a good so day, sir. Sorry. Have a good day. Thank you. Appreciate you. Bye. Oh. Oh. Eight, nine, nine, eight, nine, nine. People call me bully for that. You know, it's so funny. Oh. I'm getting so much hate for for treating our callers like crap, and and then everybody who actually posts that I'm I'm rude and obnoxious. I there's a whole battalion of other listeners like I you're new. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. like <laughs> you must be new. Good morning. Hi, this is Jay. There we go, Jay. Oh, and I love your kind of monotone, no personality. Very hard for us to do this this game, you know? Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. I, I, think I, just, I think it's just so, so bland. I'm a singer. I'm a dancer. I'm really good at um, IT. Okay, give me the three statements one more time. Go ahead. Uh, sorry? Give me the three statements. Go ahead. He is a singer, dancer. Yeah, singer, dancer, and I'm good at IT. That's only two statements. We need three. Come on, yeah, singer, I'm a singer, I'm a, I'm a dancer, dancer, I'm good, good at, at IT. IT. Oh my God. IT. You suck at this. You suck at this game too. Um, <laughs> I know, but I'm a singer, singer dancer. They're our first cousins. <laughs> Not okay, three. can you turn off your radio? Is that your radio? What Tabo, is that? Can you interrupt, please? <laughs> what is that? No, oh, that's the alarm of my car. Sorry. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. so, okay, I'm a oh, singer, yeah. I'm a dancer, I'm a basketball player, I'm an athlete. I mean, come on. Okay, fine. Um, I'm a dead, I'm a he doesn't dance. This guy doesn't have, this guy doesn't, there's no person. He doesn't sing. Um, okay, wait, lower, lower, lower his volume, please. Lower his volume, because that thing in the background is driving me crazy. Okay, IT, yes. Singer, yes. Dancer is the lie for me. Singer is the lie for me. Uh -oh. Singer K, Alex K, singer Maya, what do you got? IT. IT, okay, <laughs> Sam. I will go with IT as well. I mean, I I agree. Ooh, he I'm does not one. sound like a dancer. He doesn't sound like a singer, but then maybe like, you know, that's why he's trying to cover it up. And the IT is the curveball. Yeah, no, this guy, trust me, this guy's got, oh, that's a really good angle, Sam. <laughs> and he said, ah, uh, right before, ah. Uh. Oh, okay, I'm let's go, IT. let's go, here we go. Hey, um, what is it? What's, yeah, the, what's the lie? Singer. I'm a dancer. I'm, an, uh, I'm good at IT. Oh, you're ah, not a singer. Alex and Kay for the win. Thank you. Have a good day. Thank Message you. me Have on Instagram, time. please. Bye. Thank you. Congratulations. Aww. All right, all right. Here we go. Eight six three one zero eight nine nine. We're doing two truths, one lie. Please tell the truth, by the way, that you're actually telling a lie. Good morning. Good morning. Hi. Ah, I like this girl better. It's easy. It's easy. All right. <laughs> go ahead. Give me the three statements. I'm a first time caller. I'm my I'm on my way to work and my name is Rose. Rose. Yeah, Rose Rose sounds like You are you not like on your Rose. way to work. Oh, She's hey. too chill for a first time that caller. Sound like a car. I feel like I've heard you before. Uh, she's not a first-time caller. Diba? Parang she's, she's too... We're all she's stuck, confident, Confident and, you know, following instruction. Oh, for uh, once. Oh, not on really uh, speaker. Walang kaba. So what is it for you, Lex? Car. Uh, not a first-time caller. Also okay. my vote. I'm not What's the a first-time caller. No, 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 wait, don't give the answer, please. Don't give the answer. Did she just Hold give on. us the answer? Did you just give, did you just give the answer? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, have a good day. Get up. Bye. How's that? How's that? First time caller. 8631 We should put them on hold after they do the three statements, actually, because there's some background noise as well, uh, Sam. Okay. Good morning. Hi. Hello. 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 Okay. Hi. Yeah. Who's this? I'm Tin. Tin. We need two yeah. truths and one lie. Any order, preferably mix it up. Go ahead. I'm a theater actress. 
I'm a mother, and I'm a lawyer. Mother. Lawyer. Mother. Uh, okay, Sam. Can we get a restart, by the way, on the stream? Uh, Alvin, would you get a chance, please? Um, I'm going to go with mother. You're going with lawyer, Mara. Sam, what do you got here? I'm going to go with theater actress. Okay, we've taken all three. Kay? Yeah, theater actress. Maybe because, or, or maybe she's acting like not big. Okay, theater actress. Oh, you're, a, you're a theater actress hate, hater, I see. Okay, <laughs> fair enough. Um, Lex, what about you? Agam problema nito. Lawyer. Walang benefits at. Okay, so lawyer for Lex and Mara, actress for Sam and Kay. Again, I'm by myself on this one. I'm saying mother. What do you got, love? Sam and Kay are correct. Yes! You're not a theater actress. You could be. Thanks for the call, Mom. Appreciate you. you. Good day. Bye. 8631-0899 is our phone number. Next caller. Remember, everybody wins. This is just a competition between the five of us. Good morning. Hi. Yes, hi. Good morning. This is Dennis. Dennis. Hi, Dennis. Dennis. Three statements, Uh, one lie. Nakagat na ako ng ahas. Nasagasaan na ako. That's so true. Ano? Nakagat na siya ng ahas? Yeah. Yeah, Nasagasaan na ako ng sasakyan. Okay. Napaaway na ako sa bar. (laughs) Ang ganda. Ning second. Nasagasaan siya ng kotse. Oh, that's so good too, though. Trauro to. And napaaway sa bar. Pag ka natuwa ka ng ahas, nasagasa ka sa sakin, dapat kang mamatay. <laughs> wow! Eh, ayun na yung mundo nagsasabi sa'yo na may gustong kumuha sa'yo. <laughs> Nasagasaan ng car. At kung napaaway ka sa bar, malamang yung pangatlong sugo yun para patay ka. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Lex, you go first then. What is it? What is it, Lex? Who, what's the lie here? I'm feeling I'm leaning towards bar, but I don't know. I'm a little off today. I've, I've struck out on both. What? <laughs> okay, ang pagka- sobrang nervous mo, napaagat ka nung ahas, tapos napatakbo ka, nasagastaan ka pa ng kotse, hindi ka tinulungan ng mga tao sa bar, napaaway ka. <laughs> <laughs> Connectado pala lahat. Okay, so uh, ahas for Lex, or hindi, kotse for Lex. Kotse. Ahas for, uh, kotse ka rin, Mara? Kotse rin ako. Okay. Okay, what do you got, love? I have a story kasi about the ahas thing. I was in a shoot and kunwari nakagat ako ng ahas. So, oh. andun yung parang trainer ng ahas. Tingnan nyo, hindi to poisonous. O, oh, magpapakagat ako. <laughs> <laughs> so, parang yung ahas thing might be the lie. Okay, it's, ahas for you, Koche for Alex and Mara. Sam, you and I, what do we got here? I think I'm going to go with bar. For I'm some, going with bar as well. Yeah. Uh-uh. yeah. I'm going with bar as well. Okay. Hey. Psst. Hi, what Dennis. Okay. Yeah. Uh, five years ago, I was in car. Okay. Oh, Two right. years ago, I was in a non-poisonous car. Yes. I don't want to go to the bar. I don't drink. Yes. Good man. Uh, Good man. <laughs> high five, Sam. Right up here. Thank you. I'm going to poison. Thanks, Dennis. I'm going to high five. 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 Thanks for the call. 8631-0899. Take a next one. Two truths, one lie. Everybody wins. Sweet. Is he still still there? We didn't give any follow-up. No, he can message us. San ka kinagat? Awaga. At san ka nabangga? Pahit ka nabangga? Morning. At gano ka tanga? Hi. Hi. Good morning. This is Vic. Vic. Vic or Vic? Vic. Don't like Vic. Vic. Don't like Vic. What's up, Vic. 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 It's, it's Vic. It's so choppy. The stream yeah. is so choppy. I can't even understand anybody. Um, okay, Vic, what do you got? Two truths, one lie. Uh, I'm stuck in traffic. I'm driving and I'm on my way to work. 
That is the stupidest three. <laughs> goodbye, goodbye. Get out of the show. Goodbye. No, get out of the show. Bye. 8699 Nadala mo. Chocolate po. <laughs> Ay, ako. I, I would say, but you know, of the three, just for kicks, he is not driving. That was that was my pick. Good morning. Hello. Oops. Morning. Good morning. Hi. Hi, is this? Morning. morning. This is Arjun from Cabitex. Hi, Arjun. Uh, I used to work as a pump attendant. In, a what? Uh, a what? Pump it. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Uh, I used to work on a strip club. Uh, Ooh, that's the truth. I used to work in a bank. Bank. Band. Band. A yeah. bank, bank or, or bank? a bank? Bank. 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 Okay. Bank. Bank. okay. bank, strip club, gas station. Where are we at? Mario, you're going with bank. Yeah? Yeah. Sam. The strip club. Ako gas station. Okay, we've done all three. Ako, ako bank. Bakit? Kasi kung totoo isa doon, kung halimbawa sa ano ka ng pump, kailangan mo talaga ng pera eh. Ah, Kaya so pwede kang mag strip club. Pag nag strip club ka, hindi ka talaga pwede, ibig sabihin, wala kang, hindi ka pwede magtrabaho sa bank, tapos ano, nag apply ka, ano trabaho mo previously? A strip na po ako, a dancer po ako ng strip club. Wait lang. Oh. Sandali, sandali, sandali. Oh. sandali. So sabihin mo, sandali, sandali. Wait lang. <laughs> <laughs> Nawawala ka lang limang taon. Wala sa rest of mo yung five years. Ano ginawa ko sa five years? Hindi ba kayo yung sideline lang? Hindi ko po pwede sabihin. Baka ano, working student siya. So, uh-uh, oh. he used to work ako, at a... Ako, sumayaw na ako sa strip club, pero sa Singapore. Pero, pole dancing naman. <laughs> Can I get a recap of what everybody's chosen? Alex says bank. Mara, you said what? Bank. Okay, Sam? I'll just stick to my guns. I'll do strip club. That's okay. what she said. <laughs> <laughs> pumping station. Just stick to my guns. <laughs> I'm going to say pumping station as well. Okay, you and I are in this together. The rest are on their own. Let's go. Good morning. What is it? Good morning. Uh, I used to work in a strip club uh, as a manager. Actually, I, I, I handled the, What's the, pump? the strip club. Yeah, yeah. Uh, then I used to work in a bank. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So it's it's the pumping station. Yeah. yeah. Thank yeah. you. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye. See? Good one. Because he sounds like. Oh, 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 Hey, when you said he sounds like, were you trying to say he was too eloquent to work as a pumping guy? No, I was just saying, I just wanted to bring it back to when I worked in Orchard Tower. It, it there is no shame in it. It just sounded a bit proud about it. So that's managers it, managers uh, okay, managers yeah. Mm-mm. Eight six three one zero eight nine nine. Two truths, one lie. Here we go. Good morning. Hello. Hi. Good morning. Hi. It's Yolo. Yolo. Obviously, your real Yolo. name. Hi. Hello. Yes. Yes. Go ahead. It's Yolo. Yes, we know. Go ahead. <laughs> Two truths, yeah. one lie. Okay. Uh, I had sex with my fifty-year-old boss. 50-year-old boss? 50-year-old boss, yeah. Okay. Um, I was jailed once. Oh, these are good. Not barangay. Jailed. Not barangay. Not barangay. It's jailed. And give us the lie. Uh, I worked in show business before. Hey, can you remind me before I knock him out what he did for all three of those? <laughs> later, later, later. Follow-up questions were okay. I Why were you jailed? Well, what did you do in showbiz? And what was the first one? Oh, you had sex with the 50-year-old. That's the question I want. Okay, let's go. Um, Sam, you want first digs at this or what? I do not. Okay, Alex, who wants it? Mara, Kay, who wants first? 
Um, yung second, yung... Jail. No, yeah, jail. Kasi he slept with a 50-year-old because he was in showbiz. Eh, kung he was in jail. <laughs> Very Why good. Was... Very good. The sex and the showbiz are are, are intertwined. Okay. Pwede sa jail na kailala. Lola nung... Yung... Oo, pwede oh. na yung 50-year-old boss mo sa, sa kulong ng kulong. Ang <laughs> bilang boss, papakawalan kita dyan. Mas may pag-sex ka sa akin. Opo, opo. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Lex, what are you going with here? Ah, uh, this is nakulong. Okay, so I'm Alex and Mara again, hand in hand. Kay, what do you got? Hmm, the barangay thing possible? I think it was the boss. The boss was not fifty. Oh, oh the age. Age. Well, yeah, the sex is the, the, the selling point here, not the age. Oh, well, the, I think it's the age. Because you know how they would do that. The age. If, he, if he does that, we're going to knock him out. Oh, the sex, is the, the sex is the highlight of this. The 50-year-old is just a little... Well, I think it's that. Okay, the sex. Sex with the boss. Um, Sam? I'll say showbiz. Okay, to see Sam. Okay, to see Sam. It's just yeah, I know. Uh-uh. I don't think anybody lies that they've been in show. You know, everybody in showbiz always wants to remind everybody they're in showbiz. You know what <laughs> I mean? Baka, ano, baka frustrated artista siya, but he yeah. never so, made it. Uh, and we say showbiz, nag-extra lang yun. You know what I'm saying? Showbiz is the truth. It's talent. Excuse me. Showbiz is the extra. Talent. I Hopefully he surprises Jailed us. or sex. Mm, I'm going to go with jailed. Jailed is the lie. He had sex. Because you boast about sex and you boast about showbiz. You don't boast about going to jail. All right, sir, what is the lie? Are you there? Hello. Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh. Are you? Hey! Are you going to call us? Hey! 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 DM us on IG the answer. No. Oh my God. Okay, one last one. We can't go out that way. One last. Here we go. Good morning. Hi. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Hi, who's this? Rooney Man here. Um, Two truths, one lie, fire away. I am a major relationship assistant. I am seven years single. And... I used to play, uh... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? That wasn't me. <laughs> what is wrong with these people? Oh. They're trolling us now. <laughs> so oh my God. Like so I'm going to cover them sa bab- sa sa showbiz. Showbiz. Ah, okay. 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 Yeah, natin doon. Ba't ka nai-pag-sex sa 50? Ba't ka nakulong? Yeah, yeah. Diba? That's- yeah, because two of them were true. We need to, we need to follow up on that one. Di ba? Okay, yeah, but Pero, yeah. considered jail ba yung barangay? Oh! Na, 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 may mga kulungan sa barangay. Makulong no, ka I ng... know, pero jail ba yun? Oh, Hindi may ba mga kulungan. Ka yes, lang? prison. The difference is between jail and prison. Uh, oh. Okay, jail is, you, you know, what you would be held in, kind of like a city jail. Prison oh. is after sentencing. Uh, Medyo pag naano ka na, matindi ka na. Prison yung, ano, matindi. Yeah, prison is like, you, you're, 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 You've been, you've Hindi, pag nakulong ka sa barangay na kulungan ng Friday, labas mo na lunes. Wala opisina ng Sabado at Linggo. <laughs> okay, he said he was, it was show business that that was the lie. Show business. Yes! It was what it was. All right, one last thing. Paano nga, John? Ba't siya nakulong? At ba't siya na ipag-sex sa pinag-sex? Ba't siya nakulong? Ba't siya nag-sex sa pinag-sex? Send those answer, Hans. Good morning. Hello. 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 Good morning. Hi. Hi. Good morning. Oh my God, I didn't expect that I will be in call. But yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, I know, right? <laughs> for the two truths. Uh, love you, love you, love you, love you. What's your name? Okay, okay. Uh, first, coding ako na nag-drive going to work. Second, Today. I'm pregnant. Third, hindi pa alam ng family ko na I'm pregnant. God, second and third are so close. Okay, um... Oh, di ba? Oh, yeah. tama, no, tama, but, tama. Yeah, number two and number three cancel each other out. Because... Oh, tama. Coding ka, hindi ka coding. 
Yeah. Hindi. No, but what if she's pregnant siya. but the, the oh. family oh. knows? How can, how can, excuse me, how can she be lying? Ako? How can she be lying about number two if number three is related to number two? Oh. oh. Diba? So it's she she can, yung, oh. If she's diba? lying about number two, that means she's lying about number three. No, she she could be pregnant and her family knows because her third statement is that her family does not know about it. I know, but if her family does not oh, you mean hold on. No, it cancels out the pregnant part. It no, cancels she could two be as pregnant. the possible answer. No, she could be huh? pregnant. Either her family knows or doesn't know. I know, but when she says I'm currently pregnant, Sam, that has to be the truth. It's no long it's out of the running because it's oh, related one, to the oh, one and two lang pag pipili natin. Uh-uh, uh-uh. One and three. Yeah, that's what I, I mean. One and three lang, di ba? One and three. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's still two choices. Yeah. Don't get mad. Buntis siya kasi totoo talaga buntis siya dahil hindi ka mahuhuli sa coding pag buntis ka. Correct. <laughs> so most stop getting mad at a pregnant woman. Gosh. <laughs> so three tayo. So three. No, I'm not getting mad at the pregnant woman. Three ang lie. Wala. Three, yeah, three lie, three. Three is the lie. Go ahead. Sige. Go ahead. Uh, one is the lie, the coding. Okay, Sam, what do you got? I will say three is the lie. Okay, Mara, finish Ako up. then, three, because she will sh- um, brag about oh driving Kareel, and coding. Kareel, coding do we- do we, do we, do, this, this is huge. This is huge, K, for your uh, employee of the week. Um, Coding chances. is the line. Right, here we go. Here we go. Good morning. What is it? The one. It's oh! the line. Oh! <laughs> Galinga. Oh, I hate oh, you for being so nice. Thank you so much, everyone. Congrats. Thank you. Thank you. Nice yeah, congrats. Thank you. Yeah, thank congrats. you. I haven't announced it before. Wait, what? Uh, oh, that's why, yeah, number three. Uh, MMDA, uh, MMDA. Yeah. May nagdrive na buntis dyan. Na coding. <laughs> I, it's just the first time, tri- trimester, so I'm, I, I'm so careful right now. Right, right. Yeah. Kilala mo yung tatay, kilala mo yung tatay, yes? Of course. <laughs> I also drive, drove with him. Okay, ah, just okay. checking. Yeah. All right, thanks for the call, sir. I appreciate you. Thank you, take care. Oh, so... You know what's funny? You said that, Kay. If if two and three weren't related, I was going to go with number two because she was so happy. Number Jesus. one. So cute. All right. Well, that's how we she, played. She's also lucky because... Ang babae talaga na sisinawaling sa une. Tapos, kasi sabi na totoo sa pangalawa at pangatlo. It should be two lies. If that's the case, Lex, it should be two lies, one truth. Hindi, usually yung babae, inaanda niya yung sinungaling sa simula. Tapos yung dalawang totoo, yung pangalaw at pangatlo. Yan ang pattern. Mm. Yeah. You guys, you all have to message me on Instagram to get the pilot gift packs, please. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but <laughs> nasa si, sabi hindi mm-hmm. makapag-participate sa akin. Huh? <laughs> kasi, kasi nagtumasagot sa Instagram na, no, no, no. <laughs> what? I gotta take a break. When we come back, we'll have more of the show and hour number three. It's good times here at Magic 89.9. Don't go away. Back Good times. Straight to Carpenter with hour number three of our show now at 8.03. Good times here on Magic 89.9 and fine, Sam, fine. Now we'll do it, yes. The much-awaited, much-delayed roll call. Wherever you are oh around the world. Oh my gosh, latest ever. Tell us. We'd love to say hi to you and the, the city and country that you may be currently at. And let's start with Panotsky, who's in Kainta Rizal. Good morning. Panotsky. He's in Sydney, Australia. Lodi Sepasi. Mike. Tennessee for Chifu. Hello. Makati for Reg. Hi. Chicago for Chris. Hey. Sydney, Australia for Australia. Morning. Uh, Crystal Love is in Davao. And let's just name off a bunch of cities here. More Melbournes, more QCs. Valenzuela, hello. Novelichas, what's up north? Uh, and more New Zealands. Two more New Zealands. Both are in Auckland. Um, Maymanda, South Korea. San Diego, Pinondo, Las Piñas, Daspa, Cavite. Mexico, Pampanga, Saskatoon, which is in Canada. Malaysia, hello. Kansas City, Missouri, what's up? Japan, hi. Summerlin, Vegas, what's up? Thank you. Zamboanga, hello. Okay, that's enough. We're good. Thanks. What's the count there? I know people are taking a count. Singapore, hi. Dallas, Texas, hello. Sukhat, hi. Edmonton, hello. Japan, hello again. More Melbourne. Lexi, you have a Melbourne show? Yes. Yeah. Better. November 16. And may na plano pang Brisbane eh. Ipapasok ko lang sa sked. Nice. Oh, yeah. You should connect with Diana Zubiri. I don't know where she's no, from. Yeah, Whoa, she's from Lex. You want to connect with Diana Zubiri. Hindi. May kaibigan naman kami Diana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, and her. Hey, she's also a comedian herself. She's here though now, but then she's got lots of friends in. 
Oh, si Australia. Siya nag-rego dun sa mga bars na pinag-performan ko during pandemic. Cool, 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 cool. Pandemic. Okay, sounds yeah, good. Pero ganda siya. <laughs> okay na, okay na mo? Yeah, yeah. Just try. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm glad Maganda. I don't remember what she looks like actually. She is great. She's beautiful. Sexy. Especially pag walang makeup. I love it. Have you guys ever been reverse catfished? What does that mean? Like they look I'm better sure. in person? Yeah, they look better in person. Is there uh, such a thing as reverse catfish? Is, is it, wouldn't that be actually better of to do? Like put a le- put a lesser attractive photo on your social media and your dating app, and then when but, they meet you in person, you're like, "Oh my god, I, I thought you were a five. Oh, oh my god! Nung nagguess ako sa Showtime, sobrang ganda ni Kay sa makeup niya. Together, me and Kuya Alex. Ah, so she, reverse cat, she reverse catfish too, you're saying? Like, oh, mas oh, okay. maganda siya person up isa dito sa... Tingnan mo yung mukha niya. You're telling me Parang that that ganyan. is better? Parang ganyan. Oh, di ba, nagkita kami nung ano mo ka ito. Nagkita kami early. Ano, nung, nung ano, Thursday. Sabado. Pag tingin na Sabado, sabi niya, mahal lang yung makeup colleagues pero sobrang nag-double look ako. Sabi, uy. Oh. Maka <laughs> 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 full glam, maka for oh. SM Little Stars. Because I've not seen you guys, Lex... <laughs> I've seen Sobra you. Sobra namin so, ganda. Yeah, in yeah. person, oh. <laughs> okay, okay. Ito, ito. Mahihimatay ka. Thanks, Sobrang Lex. guwapo ko mo. Lex. So, magugulat ka. Lex. In the hair. Shut up, Kate. <laughs> <laughs> Who of the three looks better in person? Wait, did Sam disappear? I'm here. No, Sam's right there. Three nga eh. Who of the three? Kay, Mara, and Sam. Who I of the three looks? I can't see Sam. Saan ba may mawala akong dalawang kaibigan? <laughs> <laughs> sa looks ka ba ng tanong sa akin? Um, Mara as is. Maganda talaga. What to see? Ganun din. Parang mm, si Samo. <laughs> si Samo. Boom. Pag nakita nyo sa personal. May, that, may added. Parang kimchi. Mm, parang ganun. <laughs> parang move. Oh, parang ganun. Si Kay. Delicious. Kung lalong... Sige, pag nakita nyo yung contour ng mukha in person, ma-amaze ko, oh my God. <laughs> Sobra, sabi ko sa inyo. Okay, so what's the answer? Well, sinabi ko na kayo sa inyo. Ano yung safest answer? Sinagot na kita ng beauty pageant, nasagot ko sa pa. Matalino. <laughs> Uh, yesterday I was we talked so much about food yesterday. Mara, Alex, you were in here. And the whole the whole show was almost about food. Uh-huh. And... I think we're saying because in Korean shows, there's a lot of eating in Korean uh, dramas. Yes, Sam? Mm. And hey. I mean, mukbang, hey, the mukbang originated from Korea. Yep. Oh, yeah. 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 It, there is so much eating in Korean shows, Sam, that I ate at a Korean restaurant last night, Paldo. Oh, right. I had so much Korean food. Uh-uh. My breath. I don't know how to fix this today. <laughs> Lex. <laughs> Do everything that you just said about how she now put the breath on top. <laughs> <laughs> what is the single greatest eating scene in every TV show or movie? Oh my gosh. That's the What's question it? I want to ask you. The single greatest eating scene. And Lex, please don't say something from Pornhub. Please. Oh, 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 what about the one in um Indiana Jones where there were monkey brains? But in this ano, in this food, ano, ah, parang pelikula lang. Di ba? Ano hindi siya food ano? Hindi siya hindi siya food book. Ah, hindi siya food show. Hindi ganun. hindi siya. Kailangan oh. talagang movie lang ah, ah, na masarap ah, ah. yung kainan. Tama? Oh, no, 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 one more time. Hindi What's yung katulad na pinanood mo yung ano yung the bear, yung bear, di ba? Kainan yeah. yun eh. Kaya balaga may pagkain. Maganda yung hindi mo yung expect na may masarap na pagka na kainan doon sa movie na yun. Maybe the question is probably more you know how Lex when we when we watch basketball games, the thing we want to do right after the game is go play basketball. Oh. So this is like one of those things where this eating scene was so amazing. I had to go do my own. Right. Yeah. Yes. The single greatest eating scene in a show or a movie. Oh my god! Can I can I say something? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like no no okay you go last you go please. last. Go, 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 go. Like if you watched Secretary Kim, what's wrong? <laughs> 
Okay. Kaya na pasensya ko kayo, okay? Nagsasabi na nga ako sa chat na ang baba na. There you go. Got to move the baby top. All right. So, okay, go, go. there was this show. It's called What's Wrong with Secretary Kim. Okay. And in this scene, when a guy supposedly invites you to ramen yon, that means they want to, like, get it on. So, that's the scene. So, they're eat- if the guy prepares the ramen and then you eat it, barring, there's going to be a nice kissing scene after. So, <laughs> now I just try to buy the ramen so that I can have a nice kissing scene after. <laughs> but... There was one pala, Lee Min Ho, no? He cooked steak and rice in... What movie was that? What show was that? The King? A chingo. No, 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 no. The King. The one where he's the king. Oh, the way he time travels? He's in like a white uniform. King. Parang <laughs> of the Navy. Oh my God. That Are we talking one. about the food or Lee Min Ho? Lee Min Ho cooking my steak and rice. Yes. This is too hard for me. That in is the uniform. king. Apparently it's the king on that one. Yes. Okay. All right. Yes. LM, yeah, LMH has already food himself. He is a dish. No. Right? He's a snack. <laughs> No, 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 mga, ang sarap man ganito dahil kay Bruce Willis. Pero pag nanonood ako ng merong Brad Pitt, na ako makakain si Brad Pitt. Brad Pitt is the answer here. La- lahat yung ako napapakain. Every single. <laughs> every single. Well, what does he eat? Like what Mas- movie? Mas- what are you talking about? Which one is this? Brad Pitt is known. Nah. Yeah. So, so you know how Tom Cruise has the running scene yes. in every movie? Uh, uh. Brad Pitt is a eater in every movie. Is he will right? eat. Yeah. And uh, is very yeah. well known for this. Yeah, there's a are, lot of big Are games. guys more privy to this information? How come I don't know no, this? I didn't know that. that. This is a movie thing. <laughs> what does yeah, he eat is. in Legends of the Fall? I loved him. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm I'm sure. Can you tell me the minute? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> in every single one. And then the Lee Joe Black one, I think he was doing with the with the, with the peanut butter or something like that. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that one I remember. It is, it is like Tom Cruise running. Brad Pitt eating. So let's get some answers here. 8631-3899. Playback.tv slash good times. What's the best eating scene in a movie or a show? This is a tough kind of question, to be honest. But let's see if we can answer it. Good morning. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi, who's yeah. this? Yes. Um, I, I don't know if this is count. count? Um, um, can you turn off turn your video, Everything please? in the background. Okay. Everything. All right. Turn all of it off. I turned it up already. Yeah, go ahead. No, you didn't. Um, oh. Oh. No, the, that's yeah. a lie. Some- <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Everything has to be off. It's still there. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? I'm calling in the car. Okay, there. Okay, now now, now it's... the playback for a second. You'll, you'll be able to come back in. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now, okay, now. Uh-oh. Come on. I don't know if this is um, okay. when Harry met Harry. Mm. When Harry met Harry. Yeah, the scene in, in the... Uh, oh, cat's Mary. belly. <laughs> when Mary met Harry. The scene <laughs> of the... Um, I have now, I want to have what she's having. That one? I think that's the, the chicken. The chicken? It's the, it's the orgasm. Yeah, yeah, the yeah, one yeah, with the yeah, pastrami yeah. sandwich, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't actually, I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay. The, the, you know what? This is a really good answer, actually. This is a very yeah. classic scene. Yeah. Um, no, good answer for for all that headache you gave us. That's a good answer. I'm Thanks sorry. for the call. Appreciate I'm you. Sorry. Thank you. Yeah. And regarding no Brad Pitt, I think started in Ocean Eleven, uh, Ocean Twelve. Then the Mexican, he's eating. Yeah, yeah he like, eats up all of the movies. Uh-huh. But thanks. Yeah. yeah I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. Right. Right. Yeah. <laughs> um, the Avengers, the end of the Avengers, where they all kind of sit together and eat. Where were they eating again in that one? Does anybody recall? They were kind of like at a diner, right? They were eating something specific. Shawarma, yata. It was like, yeah, yeah, it's shawarma. All right. Next call. 8631-8999. Best eating scene in a movie or show. Good morning. Yes, hi. Um, hi. Movies. Ang dami. Yung... Uh, Julie and Julia. The part where the publisher was trying to uh, use um, the recipe for bu- beef burger. Then, 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 
What movie? It is, is a this? food movie. Julia. 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 Yeah. Meryl Streep. Uh-uh. Oh, Julia Child. Yeah. Nice. That's okay. Next. All right. Is that it? Yes. Thank you. Okay. Thank, Thank you, you, love. Thank Appreciate you. you. Have a good day. Y- Bye. Yung caller natin, yung parang nakapila sa fast food, yung pagsunod, ang haba ng pila, tapos yung sunod na siya bilang, oh, what will I order? Ang dami. Lady in the Tramp. Yung spaghetti. Oh, that is such a good answer. This oh my God. Yes. Good spaghetti answer. and meatballs. Have you guys ever done this in real life? This scene? Yeah. I will now. Ay. <laughs> ito, 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 share ko lang. Pag nakakita ko ng mga eksena sa, ano, sa movie, yung kumakain sila ng Chinese takeout, yung nasa Chinese uh, box uh, na gano'n, uh, 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 tapos yeah, parang yeah. nag-iimbisiga sila ng ano, sabi kong sa... Oh, it's always so good. Yeah. Tapos yung ano pa, yung uh, pizza nila, sa, di ba pag uh, naglumbas yung pizza, yung order, tapos ang sarap, no? Yeah. Kung That's order tayo na grab. Or lawyer stuff, right? Yeah, like they're sitting there, they're, they're trying to break down the case, yeah, and they're just eating uh, take out Chinese. That's a good scene. Yeah, you're right. right. What about I know Harold and Kumar goes to White Castle? Hi, burger! <laughs> that was yeah, L and CJ's thing. Yeah, yeah, L went to that place, White. Wait, I, I want to say white girl. Sorry, that's a children's home. <laughs> he had like ten of those, and di ka naya ng chan niya. Yeah, they're small ones. Hey, hey, this is for the show time, mommy. Okay. Good luck, huh? <laughs> yeah, she asked us. Is it is it okay? We're like it's early. Uh, lines are full. Six three five two eight. First communion. Here is the best scene. Somebody just said right now, and I agree with this one gazillion percent. Ron says Pulp Fiction's Kahuna Burger scene is the single greatest eating scene in the history of movies for me. Kahuna. Uh, yeah. I don't know what that is. Oh my god. It's a yeah. It's a scene where where oh the Samuel L. Jackson thing here is amazing. Good morning. Hello. Hi. Good morning. Hello. I was just. This Kara. Hi Kara. Hi Kara. Hi Kara. Yeah. Um. The Parasite movie. The spaghetti. Yeah, the category. Oh, <laughs> right. Yeah, that's a big one. That's By one. the way, your yeah. audio situation is so ideal. It's so oh, her. Thank you. I'm actually in the middle of Ed Sand. Really? You're you're yeah. driving. Yeah, I'm driving. It's like pristine. Mm. Oh my gosh. How's the traffic oh, situation on Edsa right now? So bad. It's really, really bad. Yeah, where, where, whereabouts are you? Oh, it's bad. Sorry. Uh, where, where on Edsa are you? Um, near the uh, the U-turn in Santolan. Mm. Ah, nako. Patagal tagal ka patanggal. Nightmare. Yeah. <laughs> oh, pagka umorder ka na pagkain sa mga street vendor, lulutuan ka sa harapan nila. What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> thank you. Safe. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Have the reason I was day. asking is we used to do this thing on the show where <clears throat> somebody called in their own EDSA. We tell them to lower their window so we could hear the EDSA. And then we'd ask everybody who's listening to the show to beep mm. so we can wow. see the it on the thing. And you just hear the whole EDSA beep through the window. Wow. I'm getting it. Let's do it. Yeah, it was cool, but when she said Santola, I can't deny the demographic. I think you have to do that. We should ask if she were northbound or southbound. Oh, okay. Babaing buntis na coding. Oh, so. No, but it was always so cool. You know, we'd lower the window. We'd say, okay, if, if you're listening to the show right now, we need you to beep. And then you just hear beep, 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 like the whole <laughs> way through the window. So it's kind of cool. um, <clears throat> But according to Kay, the only one would be beeping would be our girl here who called the show. <laughs> that is my fear. No, no it's not. No, we will not hear anything. <laughs> It was according Wait, to the, the guy yesterday. It's going to be like a sheep in the quiet place. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of Do movies, what's the best it? eating scene? Best eating scene in the movie. Oh, I got another eating. one. Go. But it's not eating. Friends. <laughs> and it made you want... <laughs> oh, it's like hang out coffee. coffee, right? Coffee. coffee. So it made people want to hang out in coffee. Ah, yeah. Guys, I have another one, Friends. but it's not eating. Oh, they're swimming. Better <laughs> drinking the man. They're drinking. In Central Park. No one told you life was gonna be this way. Is that more? Sasakyan mo lang talaga yung mga trip ng mga tao dito para hindi. 
Okay, hello nga pala sa video. Naman. Video ba yan ni Road? Ako yung nasikaso ni Hector sa ni we Arnold. We find ways. Pang statement natin. Thank Next you. Next caller. Here we go. Good morning. We're talking hello, about the best good morning. eating scene. I'm Ralph. Good morning, Hi, hello. everyone. Hi, Ralph. Hi. Yeah. Um, what makes this a good uh, example if it's a dark comedic value? Uh, remember that scene in Game of Thrones where... Oh. Right where um, Ramsey had just cut off uh, Theon, Theon's mm. penis. Oh, it's, it's his uh, And he was eating uh, a sausage. Mm. That made you want to eat a sausage? Yeah, yeah. No, this is such a great, yeah, this is such a great answer as well. Um, yeah, that Bolton boy was, was horrible. And yeah, we cut off his, yeah. It was, it was a great cut too. Um, yeah. Good, good call, good call. Very good. Thanks, right. man. Thank Thanks. you. Bye-bye. I would want to avoid a sausage after that. Jeff has a really good one. Sam, you know, you would probably relate to this. We watched Billions together, right? Oh, I've never seen Billions. Oh, did? Okay, I thought it, maybe it was in... Uh, you and Nico, Nico, I think, yeah. Yeah, but Bobby Axelrod would eat pizza. And he has a small mouth. And <laughs> just his gigantic chews that he used to do. It would irritate me because his mouth was so small and he ate so much that it had a weird kind of ratio But to chipmunk it. feels... Yeah, it's just, ugh, it was like, ugh, yeah, no, not, not a fan. But yes, very memorable. Um, one last call. Let's see here. Good morning. Hi. Hello. Hi, good morning. Hey. Hi, who's this? Hi, this is Zach. Zach. What's up, yeah, Matt? So We're talking about the uh, eating scenes in the show. Yeah, K-drama reference. So I remember that scene from Crash Landing on you uh, when uh, the North Korean uh, team uh, ate the BBQ chicken. So I think that oh that time, yeah uh, you yes. know first time palang na wala pang BBQ chicken in the Philippines, uh, but when it arrived here, I immediately went to their branch and then yeah, mm-hmm. I was able to relive that uh, moment. It's kind of related to my experience ng scene na yung sa Kloy. Nice. Ah, you know, landing on you. Yeah, yes, you know, this I is such it. an amazing answer. I think BBQ chicken just took off in other countries because of this, the the exposure it got on Crash Landing. And I don't know, Sam, if you would agree, because Crash Landing came out, Baby Q Chicken was like monster because of the show, uh, to a point where I remember on my flight simulator, I landed, I think it's Sydney, Australia, and I could see the BBQ Chicken through the window oh my on gosh. the inside of the terminal while I was parking my vehicle. Wow. My, my airplane. It took like, a while. What the hell is the BBQ? Like, it's that popular. Uh-oh. It's crazy. It took a while, because- but it finally made it to Philippine shores as well. Yes. It's here. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Which yeah, is yeah, what's weird to me is it's all the I'm subway. Sure. But there's always like a uh, subway sandwich. Like office workers are always eating subway sandwiches for lunch. Yun yung opposite. Parang it does not make me want to eat it. Mm. Parang it's not an exciting sandwich. With no psychic hack. Subway sandwiches aren't very. Not subway. What are you talking about? Subway the brand or just subway? No, because in K dramas, the brand. Sobrang madaming subway uh-uh. scenes, no? Subway, subway yung brand mismo or oh, yung sandwich? Oh, the brand, the brand. Yeah. Oh, the brand. Please sila sa mga K-dramas. Yeah, they uh, advertise a lot. Uh-uh. But it doesn't make me want to eat a sandwich. Strange. Oh, it thank you. Work. Kumbaga, it doesn't always work. All right, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, my God. Thank it's you. Hi. Thank you. Right. <laughs> hanging out. Okay, which, which super mainstream fast food restaurant have you just not eaten in forever? Subway would be my answer. I don't think I've had a Subway oh, sandwich in. Oh my gosh. Same old, same old. Oh. It's not that healthy. It's not? People think it's healthy, but it's not. I know, because of that guy who lost weight, they were eating just that. I remember that, yeah. Uh-uh. Is it 100 pounds? I think, that was, I think they were trying to answer that it was healthy enough that the uh, guy was It's good enough. Weight. But I read, Mara, I did read something about like, hey, yeah, guys, it's not that good for you. Um I have not had Subway in forever. Mm. Tara says, I love Subway. It's super yummy. Uh, Yana says, Popeyes, Taco Bell for Stell. I've had that recently. Um, Wendy's. Oh, oh, I eat it. I Subway. I promise. I promise. I Subway. I Well, there's a brand that'll never advertise on this show. I know. I'm sorry, Subway. But... <laughs> <laughs> Love, I wanted to sponsor your Cebu. <laughs> no, no, no. I need Philippine Airlines. <laughs> Cebu Pacific. Eh, Air Same Asia. owner. Same owner, Kuya Alex. 
I will eat Subway then. <laughs> <laughs> Jollibee. Sheldon says he hasn't eaten a Jollibee in so long. Oh Ay, my God. Is that possible? Ano ka ba? Landmark natin yan. Mapapakain ka talaga dyan. Saan bahay nyo? Diretso ka. May Jollibee. <laughs> Kanan mo. May Jollibee ulit. Pangatlong Jollibee ka. <laughs> Uh, DH says spam. I have no, well, okay. Spam's not a fast food restaurant. Unless, oh, spam silog. Is that is that a popular place? Because nah. mm, I don't know. Spam. Di ka ko makain spam. I don't eat spam. No, I don't eat. I just. Go. I don't like. Mo, di ka ko makain spam. No. No. Subo ko sa yung spam pag nakita tayo. <laughs> oh, my God. Ah, ilagay mo sa omelet. Hindi <laughs> niya mamamalay. <laughs> When's the last time you guys ate at Chowking? Ah, uh, a week ago. Mara, Chowking. Um, a few months ago, the masarap yung buchi. Buchi. Oh yeah. Yes. Ah, masarap kumain. Masarap kumain. Matwen ten ten madaling araw. I want to say a couple of months ago, I had their um, is it the Chinese style fried chicken? Masarap siya. Huh? Masarap. Oh. oh. Parang masarap may hint siya. of Indian ano siya no Indian taste Mas, no. Oh my, it's like spiced. Masarap. Yeah, I know. Kay, when's the last time you ate a Chow King? Ito na. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. No, 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 no. I, <laughs> hey, <Kim Chuyan. laughs> This is like a super bad answer and I'm gonna get so much hate, but I haven't eaten fast food. In... <laughs> so wait, you, you don't eat fast food at all for like, so you have not nice. had Jollibee, you've not had McDonald's, you've not had... So you don't, you give up my Jollibee and Curtis and McDonald's Spice Ganda and... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I haven't eaten fast food since I saw that documentary. Oh, um, that. Um, oh, super size yeah, me. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, nice. Are you kidding me? That's how... Hey, that show is so because... hey, that show's super old already. That's how... Yeah, I think I maybe ate fries once because it was offered to me and I was trying to be polite. I can't digest it anymore. Really? Indian I just burger. that movie is 20 years old. Then that's how long I haven't been eating. Wow. Okay, burger, okay, burger, burger last time, ano, or maybe go- gourmet burger dapat. Hindi naman, pwede naman homemade. Meron oh. namang brands din na marang, di ba, meron silang healthier alternative. Uh-huh. Oh, I had a plant-based Whopper. Oh. I, I made a whole thing of it. Oh, oh I've had that. That was pretty good too. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, I think that's the last fast food I ate. Or maybe Chow King Halo Halo because Kimmy brought some. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Chow, Chow King Halo Halo. Halo Halo, yeah. Yung mga Pinoy restaurant, kumakain ka ba kay? Yes. All the time. Yung mga small, yung mga maliliit lang na brands. Okay. Like? Me, meron kami kin... It's weird to say because it's... We were near, ano eh. Like, where the cremation was in Pasig. Like, um, in Sire uh, Mundo. Pa- Oh. Meron isa doon na parang sikat eh. We oh. ordered everything. Or, ah, chicken bakolod. I love chicken bakolod. Oh, oh I love it. Alex wants you to say his restaurant. Okay. Hindi, hindi. Hindi oh, pa ako na-invite. Saan ba yan? Mitsunelli. Rockwell, Pasig the Groom. Malapit ka Sige na. nga, pupunta ako dyan. Sige. <laughs> we'll go there and we'll make a mini vlog. Mm. Yeah. Alex Calieja. Ah, balot mo na yung TV. <laughs> it is uh, 8.30 We're going to take a break When we come back We'll have more of the show You're listening to Good Times You're on Magic 89.9 Don't go away Good Times And for the rest of my life Steen Lewis Sasha Alex Sloan With the rest there At uh, 8.38 Hi everybody Hi Hello you know, when we do a topic like we did, just did a little while ago, I always, you know, Sam, you always do the work. Well, there's another one that's not going to sponsor on the show. Mm. And then I laugh and I go, oh, I know. <laughs> Burn that bridge. <laughs> and I think um, back in the day, it would be always kind of really, really taboo to say something bad about a company. But then as, as there's more transparency in the world these days and people open up shoes just to even tell you what the what it looks like inside and just there's so much exposure to what a good company looks like and what a bad company looks like and you know apple had their launch earlier today for the new iphone 16 um launching a new watch as well and all of that stuff which um generally excites uh the the, the techie group but i wanted to ask you guys if you had any thoughts on who are some of the morally bankrupt companies 
Wow. Morally bankrupt companies. Just companies that did bad business. And then I'm blaming uh, on... Include ba natin yung cigarette and... Ano, out na yun natin, ay, mga cigarettes and... Well, why are they morally bankrupt? Oh, because it's cigarettes. No, cigarette. Alam naman natin... Would you, like, would you... Would you... Would you... If you were... Pero ibig sabihin, alam mo na yung nasa karton mo, yung product, na mayroong pwedeng... Mm-hmm. Pwede kang and, mama. And then you continue to sell it. Ibig sabihin... But isn't that everything? Like, if you go back to sa- uh, sa- uh, K's fast food, fast food's so dangerous for you. Right? If it's not in moderation, I guess. I like everything. Or, yeah. Which we I guess is kind do. of the same as... We cigarettes. probably shouldn't do this topic, no? No. <laughs> I think we would offend them. all the brands. I thought you were already enlightened that we weren't going to do this topic. Oh, okay. yeah. because I'm reading some of the answers here and I'm like, oh, yeah, let's pass on that. <laughs> oh, you don't want to be. No, we can go there. Let me erase this from the list. <laughs> Never. Mo, put this, this in, your notes, in your little notebook oh, okay. and yeah. topics oh. to never open up Gone. Got pilot. Eh, na pumunta tayo dun eh. Pero by the way, yung meats and deli ni Alex nakita ko it's pet friendly. Oh. In, in what way? They won't cook your animal, or or why is it pet friendly? Like, so you can actually bring you your animal. Oh, okay. oh. If I same. had a lizard, I could bring it. Yeah, any. Aliana is just a a pet owner. Pati ako. And so. you won't turn it away, di ba? Oh, no, no. Aspens. What oh, about? No. Birds. There were some people like they have the bird like here. Okay, on turtle. Bring your turtle. Ah, yung bird nila papasuo ko hindi ka. Oh my god, Ara, we talked about turtles yesterday and how much yeah. we love them and okay. that we care for them and all of these things. And we because we we were trying to honor the fact that you are a uh, turtle collector. Yeah, and you know why I slept late last night. So an hour before I went to work, I took so, my my turtle my tortoise out in the balcony for the kailangan kasi magbask sila and magbathe under the sun for vitamin D. Anyway, I left my tortoise in the balcony. I went to work and I came home <gasps> nine hours, <gasps> ten hours later. And then when I they can only survive underwater for a few minutes lang. So syempre for nine hours he kept himself up and then by the time I got home uh, I, I got in my condo and I'm like oh shit Aesop and I go to the balcony na siya inside the inside the turret inside inside the shell so pagka pagka lift ko I just got home right on time oh. hindi siya nag blink for a few seconds and then nag blink siya to me VR mo Yeah. No, I I I had to order another. Ano ulit yung initial yeah. reaction mo? Ano initial reaction mo nung naalala mo? Paano pa no? Oh, Next. snap. Oh yeah, nice. <laughs> That's what they do, a snapping turtle, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh. Wow. Yeah, so I watched my tortoise all night, made sure na alive pa siya. Oh. So I think okay. 8610899 you almost killed your animal. No, <laughs> that's not the topic. Oh. But But yeah, yeah. Deli, eh, ano yun, pet friendly we lugar. will bring Ako. Finny and Aesop. Oh, Finny once got bitten by a bee. Oh, closing her eyes like Aww. that. I thought she was going to die. But we went to sleep. <laughs> and then she was alive. <laughs> But you know, Alex, you know what I like? Yung ano? pabang restaurant na pet friendly. Pag nagbibigay sila ng bowl na may water oh, for dogs. Oh, yeah, that's so oh. sweet. Oh, pati sa owner, binibigyan din namin para... <laughs> <laughs> para equal. Okay, equality. Hey, do, do restaurants <laughs> discriminate? You know, Mara, what's nice is when they give a bowl for your turtle to die in. <laughs> do do restaurants discriminate according to the breed of your dog? Like, why was there Ay. an Aspen question kanina of like, kahit Aspen, you're gonna let them Kasi in? Kasi may issue ngayon. May uh, issue ngayon. Ano, ano? I'm asked the question. Oh. Basically, um, this person went to Tagaytay ata, tapos hindi pinapasok kasi Aspen yung dog. No. Tapos <laughs> nagkaroon ng big, 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 big issue and a lot of people actually I was just checking it this morning and dami ng bad reviews for this specific restaurant. Pina, parang pinapapasok lang and the thing pinapapasok lang mga shih tzu. Sinabi na ay hindi ka pwede hindi pwede pumasok yung aso mo because um, uh, overweight pero they let in Labradors. No. Which I'm okay with this. Can I, I say I'm okay with this? You're okay with Aspen's no, being discriminated at a pet friendly restaurant? It's pet friendly. 
Ito ay Aspen is uh, pina, ano na, politically correct na Asong Askal. Pinoy. Asong Pinoy. Dati yung... Why we can't say Askal anymore? I don't know. We're trying to change it just because it's, you know, I don't know. Hey, here's my thing. Where are you soccer team? I just, I just need to, I just need a little more, more information. Nothing. Okay. About? Was the Askal literally from outside and they were just bringing it in? No. no alaga that, nila. This is their alaga. alaga. Uh-huh. Wala lang breed. Wala lang siyang, I mean, hindi siya. Wala lang breed. Hindi siya but it wasn't like Askal or was it just a mixed breed of just a bunch of other stuff? Yeah, but it was in their car. It's it's their I don't know if it's adopted. I'm not sure, uh, but that's their ina as, ina alaga nila yan. Per se, aspin talaga siya. Na hindi siya ano. Na inadapt nila. Adopted, pasok sa talaga. Mm-hmm. Sa, okay. Oh. Yeah, that kind of sucks. That kind of sucks. Yeah. Kaya yung restaurant ni Alex, it's pet friendly. Doesn't matter what breed. Yeah. You only accept Aspen. In retaliation. <laughs> That's a joke. Uh, so, oh, Ajan accepted. You, you know what? You know what has social media done kind of positively here, Lex? When it came, you know, we we're talking earlier about like online bullying and all that stuff. Because when we bully businesses. Like that's acceptable because they don't have like a soul. It's just a structure. It's just a business. But these businesses have the right to refuse entry. It's, pri- it's private. It's a private business. They have the right to refuse oh. business to anybody they want, and they don't have to stay. Why? I, I just don't. I don't like your Askal. That's it. Period. Private business. No problem. Right. Um, but this is where again the social media bullying stuff actually comes to a positive. Okay, now we're just gonna rip you guys review wise, and all of a sudden they suffer. So. Ako ano ayoko lang ide reverse yung card na ipaglalaban mo yung no to ano discrimination. Tapos ang ganti mo is also the same. Ang gusto ko lang pagka nagginawa na ng ng ko ano man siya man involved. Hindi lang itong issue na to. Pagginawa niya nara rapat, we stop. Kasi minsan ang nangyayari, mm-hmm. alibawa, nag-apologize. Titingnan naman na, hindi naman sincere eh. Doon na tayo pumunta. O iba naman, ba't ngayon nyo lang ginawa? Alam mo, <laughs> doon mahaba eh, after the ano. Kaya hindi mo na malaman ngayon yung issue. Alibawa, eh, for example, yung restaurant na yon, nagsabi na lang formal apology. Ang pinantopic ngayon, siyempre napansin lang kayo. So, so, hindi mo na ngayon alam ang... Out well, how often? Look, I have actually a topic written down here, and I was just waiting for one of these days to throw it out there. Sam, you're really struggling with your <laughs> uh, with your conscious <laughs> staying awake here. But, trying. Um, how often are apologies sincere? How 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 often are your apologies sincere? Sam, let's start with you. I'd how like often to, are your apologies sincere? Would I, you say I, I, high I, high percentage? I'd like to think that yeah, I if I do actually apologize, then I I am coming from a sincere place, and I do try not to make the apology. You know how like sometimes the wording is like, oh, oh the wording if is so I important. hurt your feelings, then I'm sorry. Oh you mga Thank ganon, yes. parang walang kwenta. Yeah. Like if you're gonna yeah. apologize, just take the hit and apologize. Oh, bagalan ni. Sa parang ano? Parang nakakatawa sa social media. Parang gusto nila isob. Sa social media din. Mm. Some, some topics or some issues can be resolved privately. For example, yan. Hindi natin alam nangyayari yun kung anong ginagawa ng restaurant na yun to reach out. Ang gusto kasi lahat, pag nasimulan sa social media, lahat ngayon nakabalaanda sa social media. Eh, ang problema, lumalala because of the reaction and whatever. Uh-huh. Pero hindi naman natin lahat Don't you think that has to be done? I mean, it, to oh. save their business, it has to be done in, in social oh, media. Pero it's where all pero, the attention. Oh, yun nga. Yun nga nangyayari ngayon. Kaya, kaya hindi mo na alam ngayon yung totoong apology sa hindi. Kasi nga, lahat, bibigyan ng kulay, mm-hmm. lahat ng actions mo moving forward. Kasi dun, ang nangyayari dyan, ang gusto naman ng tao, chismis eh. Sa totoo lang, pinipid na sa social media and chismis. Yeah, but the chismis has a peso amount to it. Uh, <laughs> I know. Ayun nga problema sa atin eh. Ayaw natin pag... Pero pag tayo nang involved, saka na tayo kinaagat sa puwet ngayon. Pero pag we're doing it to someone else, yeah, it's pera. Pero pag tayo nang involved, you want to stop. So, maging concerned din tayo sa... Kasi lalabanan ka naman sa kabila ng may mga empleyado, whatever, na mawawala ng... Alam mo yun, counter-counter na yan eh. Ah... Uh, Argument, argument, nagsimula sa gayetong decision, decision. Pag nag-apology, bigyan natin ng recovery yung... Kasi, like if they reform naman yung mga mali. Oo, oh, di ba? Pag kinorek nila, kasi di, balikan ka naman ng mawawala ng trabaho yung mga tao doon. Which is counter, true. Counter, counter, counter niyan. Which is... 
all will be I, I I'm getting lost what are you saying like don't do it on social media though is that what you're saying Hindi, or? si social media mo ang akala ng mga tao ngayon sasagot ka rin sa social media eh, pero pag ginawa mo yan ang lahat ng opinion binubuksan mo sa lahat pero there are some things na nangyayari sa likod ng ng uh, social media na mas mas ano mas sincere so uh, parang fix it first and then announce na lang oh, na okay na kayo oh, kasi ang gusto ng tao ay, nakita na social media. Pwede bang i-chismis mo sa amin kung ano mga nangyari? At pag na, tumayimik na, ay, walang ginawa. No, hindi lahat ng nakikita nyo sa social media, doon dapat matapos sa social media. And that's what happening to our politics. That's what happening to our issue sa, sa, sa showbiz. And, you know, maraming counter yan. Paano naman yung restaurant na may mga tagtatrabaho? Papalik ka naman ng mga... Alam mo, ano yan eh? Hindi, hindi yan mag, magkakaroon ng good news pagka lagi mong ini-involve ang social media. That's what I'm saying. Hmm. I'm not sure. <laughs> Di ba? Hindi ko naman, hindi naman ako the word, media, the word media is right there. And I'm wondering if, you know, you use it, if you can use it responsibly and transparently, then it's a very good thing. And you want to use that. I mean, listen, companies before social media, companies spending millions, even till now, obviously, on marketing. It's how can we market ourselves to make us look good? Some of that is by showing people the right things we're doing. Some of it is to lie about what our product can do, but it really can't. I mean, it. Pero ito, ito, mo. Still media. Yung, yung aso ko, yung askal, askal o aspin ko, hindi pinapaso. Tapos nagsabi ako ng nasaktan ako doon sa, 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 ano, sa, sa may-ari. At yung may-ari, nag-resolve ng maayos. Eh di tapos sana yun. Uh, ang ibig ko sabihin, hindi dapat natin ilalabas. Ngayon, pag nag-sorry yung kabilang ano, sasabihin naman natin, nag-sorry yan kasi na-expose sa, sa social media. Oh, Ang yes. ibig ko sabihin, para man pinagbigyan mo na natin ma-resolve privately. And then, pag hindi ka inaano, hindi ka pinapansin, kasi minsan, ang pwede naman makamasettle yan privately. Lahat ng mga bagay. Di ba? Yeah, so, I think I understand what you're saying. Yung... Oh, parang sometimes it gets blown out of proportion. It oh, gets mis- ng, misinterpreted. Diba? Kahit maganda man yung intention. Wala pangit na lahat. Oh, I get it. Ko, marami akong experience na may nakikita akong ipis o may nakikita ako sa kinain ko. Ang una ko sasabihin, ma'am, may pagka may ipis o hata dito, pero hindi ko na may ipopost na yan. Parang, mm-hmm. Sasabihin ko na lang, sana po next time, kasi pag ano, hindi natin alam, mag-apologize naman, ah, sincere na sincere, kasi wala nakikita ang tao o oh, nag-apologize, ay raise it up muna. Di ba? Kasi gusto ko makatulong eh. Kasi hindi naman lahat. Eh, lang point ko. I think it comes mm-hmm. from being a business owner. You're also very considerate. Na ganun minsan yung mga issue. Oh. But, I, I, but you know what I like about using social media? And I know we've been talking <laughs> about it a lot today. We apologize. And, and Lex, you've always had a strong opinion about social media. That's why I think we can have these conversations because you're engaged with these topics. Is... Companies have to, especially like restaurants, because there's so many reviews out there now by just normal people, they have to keep their stuff on point 24-7. And I love ah, it. So the quality I love is, it. Goes up. Man, because if I'm posting every single thing, every epist to every good thing about it, they have to keep their game top. It's no longer just the A or B outside of the window that tells everybody, oh, okay, come mm-hmm. I need to be on point. And this is like food, F, okay? I'm ingesting yeah. this stuff. So it's not the I feel like, reviewer. The bad that they yeah, yeah, it's not just the, the great reviewer. journalist from Philippine Star or whatever. It's all of us now. Yeah. And now they have to have a standard that's so stupid high and they're not paying. I mean, that's what we do as business people. We used to pay writers off. I don't know how long you've been in showbiz, K. I don't know how long you've been in showbiz, Lex, but we pay writers to make us sound good been doing that forever so there's no real kind of journalistic integrity there but guess what has journalistic integrity now the people so i like it if i if i'm there man if who may eat this boom send on the post you know because they, now they got to up their game but it could also be fake Oh, well, I mean, if I put a fake epist there, yeah. I mean, at some point, if I get caught, I lose everything. But all yeah. I'm saying is there's the, the good always the bad. Mm-mm. And I love it. And I don't know matter how you feel or Sam, how you feel about that. Well, in this case, um, with, with this restaurant, for example, I like that it was posted online. Yeah, blast um, them. 
because I'm I support pets and it wasn't that because their apology said we have to take in consideration the spacing. Uh, yeah, but if it's about spacing, then you could have asked, oh, there's nothing available right now. Would you be able to wait 30 minutes, one hour? But it wasn't mm-hmm. like that. And because it's in Tagaytay, some people would travel for, what, a yeah, couple of hours, three hours, yeah. just to go there, thinking that it's it, they can bring their family there, which is their dog is part of their family. So I would like to know those things so I know where not to go. So I don't waste my time. I don't make plans to go mm-hmm. there. Mm-hmm. I, for me, I wish we would just take everything with a grain of salt and not take everything we see online as gospel truth. Sure. Unless there's video. <laughs> That's why <laughs> even if there's I'm going to go to meet Sandeli in the gro- at the Grove in Pasig <laughs> and eat there. <laughs> with Aesop, you turtle. Tur- tortoise. Tur- yeah, and with my Rizla. I have a, I have a dog also. You know what? So we're gonna support your restaurant, Alex Calleja. Oh, because pag nasa kabilang side ka, you will use your convenient truth, eh. and then until you get victimized. Mm-hmm. I don't want to judge right now, because ba mama yah, yung business ko naman na restaurant ko, ang ma 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 maputokan for something that. Tama rin tao ngayon bench ano yun nag revenge ngayon eh. parang pag nag ano ka perfect ka masyado. so. Mahirap maging perfect sa mundo na to where you're being scrutinized. So, ang gusto ko ngayon, kahit issue ng iba, let's be, let's always give the benefit of the doubt. And, or let's give space for them to improve. Uh, I mean, no, no, obviously no. things have to get better and that's why there are many complaints. So, let's just give space for them to fix things. There's some talagang aabusuhin yung ano. And ang pub- ang, pub- ang, ang Kasi we're using social media for a good thing eh. Pero may iba, ano eh, di naman natin ng mga tao malinis ang purpose for social media. Kung ganun sana. Totoo. Hmm. Okay. So, ni Yellow Snowman, sounds like something is coming out about Lex. Di ba parang, di ba? Yan ang problema. Di ba? Pag nag-comment ka, pag-comment na ngayon na ano, dyan, dyan, dyan. Ayaw na kayo mo. Ayaw mo malabas sa mga social media, yung mga bagay na bibigyan ng Nang, nang mga opinion ng mga taong walang kinalaman sa totoong nangyari. Eh pagka mat- ma- alimbawa, yung isang taong nagsalita is very, very ano, popular. Talo ka na sa opinion sa sa public. Minsan hindi naman siya, ano eh, accuracy of the opinion eh. Minsan it's the personality who's talking. Ang nakakakuha ng, ng magandang ano, exposure, yung mga popular na tao. Reg- regardless kung mali o tama. That's why they're influencers. Diba sila sabi nila, masarap kumain sa relasyon na ito. Pagkain mo, sino masarap? Because you were influenced by the people you respect and you believe. So, yun ang nangyayari ngayon. Yeah. Lalo na kung si Brad Pitt yung kumain. It's not about the correct one, but it's... Minsan yung the, ano, the, the messenger. Diba? Yeah. All right, let's get out of here. It is 8.57 on uh, the Suze. Time to say our goodbyes. Kay, have a great day. Thank um, you. This will be my outfit, so watch. It's showtime. And I think later I'll do a TikTok live around 9 p.m. Follow me at Kareel Yuzon because I want to hear if you listen to my podcast, Kay's Drama, on Spotify. I also want to remind everybody that the Manila International Book Fair is tomorrow to Sunday. Pilot will be there and they're going to have lots of activities and promos for everyone. And a trip to Barakay Raffle for every 200 peso purchase. So go check them out. And I'll be at Vantage Point Media at 1130 today. I want that. Busy, busy. How about you? Anything you got uh, lined up here today? Do you want to? Just Mobile Legends, Bang Bang, MPL, every Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And Alex Kalia has show October 11. I'm going to go. Mara, I yeah. love how you do the intros. It's just so cool. <laughs> yeah. like, you are rocking it. Yay, thank you. I love it. Talaga. I watched it like three times. <laughs> okay, you know again, when I'm... Again. Oh yeah, in 2016, when you complimented me, I never forgot about it. I felt so good. I felt so good and I felt like I think I can do more hosting gigs. Yeah. It mattered and I remember it to this day. Wow. Was last week the first time you guys met? No, but like after a long in time. In years. Uh-uh. Yeah. Oh, ako kay Mara, eight years. Since yeah. uh, TV5. 
Di ba? first second episode or something for Some, the oh, second time, a uh, third time, one with sa sa, sa wake, doon nakita kami sa, sa Meet and Delhi third sa fourth, <laughs> fourth pa lang namin ni Sam. Yeah, so And we never st- met mo. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's we'll, we'll fix that. I have a feeling I have a feeling it's happening soon. Like next year really? soon. Oh. As long as none of you guys leave the show. Because we travel body ah. siya na ano. Wait. I thought there was a bit about that. Ako dapat talaga magkaroon tayo ng travel na yung podcast oh. ano natin. Uh, oh. Cooler natin. Saan? Tell Dapat us on the chat. Dapat tumawag talaga tayo ng patulong sa Philippine Airlines, sa Air Asia. And all the fast food. Pacific. <laughs> sa mga fast food. Kung, kung gusto niyo maka, gusto niyo mag, sa ita kami na magandang reviews. Bring <laughs> <laughs> us to places where we can talk about the pros and cons of fast food eating. But, yeah, willing so, yes. to try. Willing to try fast food. <laughs> After all And, these years. Open mic later. Magpa- maglalabas ako. Oh, ng- three minutes lang? Yan. Kaya ko yan. Los, los, los Chachas Ortigas. Los Chachas. The new place. Pumasok na naman sa kusina tapos nakakita ka ng daga. Tapos ah. nagtitigan kayo. <laughs> Alex Calia jokes. Sam, Sam, okay, Sam. Ikaw ang rock ko. Huh? You're my rock, Sam. I'm, I'm, you're... Sam, oh, the sleep the rock morning. is useless. Pareho tayong puyat. Ako nga, sabi ko, natulog ako ng 8pm. Oh, I just saw. Kasi oh 8pm, kasi bataan ako, galing antok na antok ako. Kaya hindi ako oh. naka-join ng Monday. At nagpunta ako sa video, sabi sa akin ng apat na tao doon sa video, wala ka kanina sa ano ha, good times ha. Oh, thank you. Ayan na yun. Ayan na yun. Ayan na yun. Wala ka kanina. Sabi ko, sorry po. Ang Tapos dami yun, palang nakikinig sa atin. Oo, oh, sobrang oh. video. Parang na, na-absent ako para pinagalitan ako ng mga teacher ko. Sabi ng mga manager ng video, wala ka kanina. Lalo. Sabi pa video. So, yun, 8pm karong natulog kagabi. Nagising ako ng 9.30 ng gabi. Tapos pin na ako makabalik ng tulog. And it's weird. Parang ano. Hi BDO. Thanks for Hello. listening. Hello. We find ways. Yeah. Always be kind para remind natin mga tao. Always be kind. Choose kindness. Choose Mama, kindness. Mamara, no? Keep it good vibes, everybody. Yeah. Time's gotta go. We gotta get out of here. Let's go. Bye, guys. Bye. 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 Good times.